What about a Halloween track? <laughs> I gotta yeah, get caught just, up now. She was just chattering her teeth like, I'm gonna hire you for my Halloween CD. <laughs> <laughs> she just goes, woo, woo. I was like, okay, great. Are you chattering because you're cold? No. Woo, woo. <laughs> <laughs> I'll do shrieking banshee. <laughs> Nick just walks by a homeless person chattering. You know, I can really use that sound for some <laughs> Halloween music I'm making. Hey, come here. Come here. <laughs> yeah, can can I sample this? Come here. <laughs> Point your mouth. No, it's not food. Don't eat it. Stop it. Don't eat <laughs> Stop it, I'm not giving you money. <laughs> I'm not giving you money. No, I'm not giving it to you. You're supposed to moan and do it. Do that little thing you were doing moan earlier. Moan and do it. What's that thing with the pain? <laughs> do that. Have you seen that that video where it's like the lady's interviewing a drunk guy and he's like, oh, and he just like puts his mouth completely on the microphone. No. I love that one. I've seen that one with the dog. There's one yeah. where the dog eats the mic. She's like, she's like, so how do you feel about that? And he's like, Aah! no, but thank you for acting it out on the microphone. Did you know you can get demonetized on YouTube for like kissing your mic and stuff? It's uh, stop it, stop, stop it, stop, stop. Immediately demonetized. It's a I just don't. I just like like I can't demon. imagine people going through videos manually and being like, up, oh, nope, none of that. Take that That's off. It's not child friendly. Don't kiss your mic. There are children listening. Am I restarting the video now? You sure? Yeah, sorry. <laughs> now that I've completely ruined any type of flow. Yeah, fuck. I don't know how in you. the world I <laughs> I know. <laughs> this is why people think you're mean. It's all about okay, you. That's why your to... name is in the, the podcast title. It's not even because I bullied friends. you guys into <laughs> stop saying that every time. I, and I woke up and immediately scribbled it down on paper like a madman because I thought it'd be kind of funny. I haven't thought of this until I had it, so it might be stupid. And I'm trying to think of it now because my note just says Adam Sandler dream. And <laughs> so the dream, I don't usually up. get. I don't usually get dreams because I don't sleep long enough to have them. But I did Aww, Saturday. How sad. I know. <laughs> Saturday, I was in a dream that Adam Sandler and I were in a play together. And we literally just, we took, I would take a bunch of towels out of a, out of like a drying bin and ask him to name the towels. And he would go like, whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. he just name them. <laughs> so I held up like a brown towel. I was like, Adam, what would you call this towel? And he's like, what you like, dirt? <laughs> That's <laughs> inaudible. <laughs> That's it. That was the dream. It was a play where Adam Sandler and I were naming colors of it was towels. A play? On... Yeah, it was a play. Yeah. <laughs> Speaking of which, I c continued to watch Annette, and uh, it fucking hell, it doesn't make any it fucking sense. It doesn't make sense. any sense. Okay, it's okay. so bizarre. It's supposed to be from his point of view, apparently. If that helps. <laughs> All I know is there's a puppet baby, and I spent so three creepy, scenes right? trying to get a better look at it. Like, is that actually a pu that's a fucking puppet, okay. right? I really, I actually laughed very hard when he was like, "Oh, I'm stuck at home babysitting," and then he fucking sat on the baby. <laughs> See, if you haven't seen this. You look like Nick because it sounds ridiculous, and it is. There's nothing good about it. He's I don't like, know. he's like, I'm stuck at home babysitting like that's like how he says it and then like he gets oh up from i just the, now got it because he he's gets up from the baby. sofa <laughs> well, i didn't get it until right now <laughs> no that's why i thought right it was now. funny damn it i thought i, was, was I thought you were just saying it's funny because he sat on a baby and i was like yeah that's no. hilarious juliana no it was <laughs> no. she would laugh regardless she could see I that would have have like, like, baby. <laughs> Haha, <laughs> Adam Sandler, ass on baby. Wish I was that baby. Anyway. Adam Sandler. Adam Sandler? <laughs> what did I say? Oh, did I say Adam Sandler? <laughs> Adam Driver, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Damn it. He's in my fucking brain. He's here. Yeah, he won't leave. Get out of my head. <laughs> Who would win in a fight? Girl. Adam Sandler or a damn sandal? <laughs> or a damn sandal. Gosh dang it. <laughs> Adam Driver is who I was trying to say. Damn it, ruined my joke. Ruined my joke. Wasn't good to begin Dub with. it over, don't Stinky. worry. Stinky. Stinky. Yeah, that yeah, baby was it. really creepy in that movie. Yeah, so I didn't Nick, want to if you haven't seen this, I, literally all, you I can glean, it, don't all I can glean from this movie so far is that uh, Adam Driver and Marianne Cotillard, or whatever you pronounce her name, Cotier. are married. <laughs> Shut up. I don't respect accents. Just kidding. Oh, no. So I'm, they're, I'm Senor Pequinos. <laughs> Pequini. Okay, that's true. I do correct everybody on that. Uh, 
they're married. He's like, I don't know, an abstract comedian. And she's yeah. an opera singer. And that's all I can get from that so far. They have a kid. And the kid is a actual, actual like, puppet? marionette puppet. <laughs> and, it's like, and they act like it's a real baby. And I yeah. can't fucking stand it. I, Dude, I'm, it's a French art movie. What, uh, do you, what did you expect from this? I don't know. I expected some kind of linear storyline, at least. Well, God okay. The, the point is that he's a comedian, but in his real life, he's, like, the most serious, angry person imaginable. And so he's a only comedian. a... Yeah, he's only a comedian because... So me... He, he, yeah, he can, Me. he's only a comedian. But not the funny no, 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 we said I'm just comedian. angry. <laughs> yeah, he's only a comedian because he can say whatever he wants without people, like, killing him, getting mad at him and everything. So, he's like, oh, I'm, I'm a comedian because I can just say, like, fuck you. And people are like, oh, it's a joke. So, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's really good so far. <laughs> yeah, I want to see a... this movie. <laughs> yeah, oh, you haven't, you haven't finished it yet? I haven't finished it yet. I'm, I'm um, at the boat scene where, you know, something happens. I'm not going to spoil oh, it. Oh, you're only halfway through the movie. Yeah, I know. There's an hour left of this damn thing. That bothers me. You watch <laughs> movies in parts. Yeah, I, I have like, to. I know I you have, have time to. to. I know well, you don't not have gonna... time. But, like, doesn't that take away from, like, a good movie if you didn't want to I'm saying. I'm like, I'm like, Dude, it took me not... a week to do uh, Schindler's List. <laughs> <laughs> It's like lunchtime on a Tuesday, and I'm sitting there like eating <laughs> eating a chicken sandwich, and they're just killing everybody. It's oh my like, god! And I, I have to stop after like, 20 oh, minutes, and I'm like, oh, that was a good 20 minutes of murder. Anyway, <laughs> oh moving on. Oh I wonder god. what Ralph Fiennes is gonna do in the next scene. Dude, and that's gonna being make even less sense to you now because that movie is like weird, and it's like one of those like you know operas where like everything connects to everything. Like they say a quote, and then there's like connects by the yeah, well, no, they, thread possible. They say a quote, and then you know there's like a a, a callback to it in a song or whatever. Now you're not gonna remember any of it. Baby said that. Baby <laughs> said on a sitting baby. on a baby. Yeah, I was like, make sure you watch that sex scene. You watch it. It's important. You, and then you're and like, because of you, important. I was going to fast forward it. And I was like, you know what? Juliana said there's something it's important in here. No. I went. I watched through two of them. There's nothing. Two of them. Juliana. Nick, I can't stress how stupid this fucking movie is so far. There's five minutes where the, sing, the, the only line they sing in five minutes is we love each we other love so each much. We love each other so much. And then after that five minutes, he starts licking her feet. Yeah, I was mad. <laughs> Let me tell you this. You could have skipped the five minutes of singing We Love Each Other So Much, just shown the foot sucking scene, and I would have gotten that without the And you're the like, five and I would have gone in there. You're like, I would have came if you I would, just showed no, the No, no, no. Like, I would have seen that and would have been like, oh, they must love each other very much because no one fucking does that. It, mm -hmm. Just miss the movie, dude. There's not a lot of good stuff it out right important. now. It was important. No, it wasn't. Nothing happened. You haven't finished the movie yet. You can't say anything. Oh, for... Fuck, <laughs> Am I going to be back next week and be like, yo, this sex scene was so important? Yes, you will. You'll come back and you'll be like, oh, thank you so much for making me. I don't think so. I don't think so. <laughs> anyway, pass yeah, but on that one. Did you see how attractive he looked? Good golly. He looks the same as he does in every other movie. Naked? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that scene in Star Wars <laughs> where he was naked. Balls are hanging out. <laughs> That was the scene that George Lucas wanted to keep in, and they had to, like, usher him off. Like, so guys, we need, we need Jar Jar's balls on screen here. That's not how he sounds. What does he sound like? Uh, uh, we need Jar Jar's balls on, on screen. I'm George Lucas. Um, Why is he like George Bush? Penis? That's not George Bush. Do you remember? Do you know who the president was? Yes, he sounds like He was like president for eight fucking years, and you were like, that sounds like George Bush. It did, it did. Play it, it back. It did and you'll... not. <laughs> I will play it back later. Now, George Bush is... <laughs> that's George Bush. That, Look that's over a... there. <laughs> oh, there you go. Iraq. No, I was like, all you did was a laugh. I can't tell who that is. It's enough. <laughs> now, watch this drive. There's, that's yeah, that's so my I just favorite ruined... video. What favorite video? Now watch you don't know this that? drive. He, he's talking about like fighting terrorism, <laughs> and he's like, "Now watch this drive." And then he, Who? he just golf club? golfing. George Bush. <laughs> it's a real oh. video. <laughs> I don't know what we're talking about, but okay. Like, You've never like, seen this. He's like, I'll he's like, we will combat this terrorist threat. Now watch this drive. And then he just. <laughs> And then he hits a golf ball. How did I never say that? Heart. And he drives off and he goes, see you in church on Sunday. And he drives <laughs> off. <laughs> drives off a cliff. <laughs> see you in church on Sunday. Drives off a cliff. <laughs> <laughs> see you in That heaven. makes it even funnier. 
That's so. I know. I never saw that. That's funny, huh? Dude, you you never understand any of the references we make. Like I'm we're sorry. like, oh, remember it's that I'm sheltered? Yeah, we're like, remember that childhood show that literally every child that was born in our generation watched? And then you're like, I'm the baby yeah, one. Coconut, right? The baby <laughs> one. The baby. Yeah, I don't. The, still, the yeah. baby. Sorry. Do I don't you know, know who the baby is. is now? No. I mean, now I no. Actually, I don't. I don't care. I don't care to know. <laughs> Let's really go. don't. <laughs> Let's go. I don't know what you're doing, but stop it. Oh, are you talking about Rugrats? Yeah. Oh, Rugrats. Okay. We were, yeah. <laughs> the baby one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I didn't know his name until we brought it up last you time. You guys watched the baby cartoon? <laughs> <laughs> you guys watched the baby cartoon with the that yeah, black ma- baby main that character? That one black baby? Why are you describing Del Baby? <laughs> I was describing Tommy Pickles. <laughs> I remember one time I went on Google and it was like top trending things on the internet today. And it was like the first thing was like baby slaps woman. And I was like, why? And I was like, why is this top trending? And then I click on it and it's like, duh, baby. And I was like, oh, it's not a baby. <laughs> I thought it was going to be a viral video of a baby just like bitch slapping somebody. So Jill, but then I just it was imagine. a grown man being so- a terrible person. Juliana's watching a full-on video of a grown man slapping a woman. She's like, oh, what? what is this? Yeah. I came here for a I baby. I I'm the I baby. I, I think I have a screenshot of it. And you know what the number two thing trending was? Just the word feet. <laughs> that was it. This is what Twitter is. It's just they pick random nouns out of the fucking dictionary. It wasn't and that's Twitter. Trending. It was Google. It was Google. It was Yahoo News. Who looks at trending things on Google? I was looking at answers.com trending today. <laughs> Sometimes I do. You see some weird stuff. Do you? Oh, man. I, yeah, I, don't, I don't know. That's uh, My brain is still sucked up with the net, so I, I, can't, I don't have any room Good. for any of these childhood shows and dreams. We I saw, like, we saw gosh, the... We trying saw to the... get my family to watch it, and they were like, no. Yeah, I don't think so. Family? Why would you ever want to convince anyone else to watch that movie? I just wanted to talk about how weird it was with somebody. I was like, can I zoom through it and just show you guys the highlights? And they were, like, yelling at me. They were, like, booing me off the stage. And I was like, <laughs> okay, fine. Juliana, then let's, let's, I'll call you at some point when I'm finished, and we can talk about it then. Cause, okay, okay. Yeah, I am, it's, uh, it's very interesting interesting to say the least so far i didn't spoil any of it when i sent you guys videos i just sent you no you didn't you horny. could have you no. you could have spoiled it and i wouldn't have fucking you wouldn't I have known don't know what's fucking going on there's no plot and so it is what it is the cutaways saw, they make in that are terrible though the what the cutaways where it's like oh celebrity couple and then it's just like on a bad green screen and i'm like oh yeah oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> we should probably stop talking about it since no one listening to this has ever no seen will this or it. will no ever will see it. it. Just pass on it. I can't and even it. recommend it. You know what? Adam Driver's good in it. If you like him and you want to see him do some She's weird just, stuff, it, It's like if Kylo Ren was in a movie that wasn't Star Wars. That's essentially what it is. He's just brooding and moping the whole time. Anyway, no, moving like on. character in Girls more. Very quickly, this story is short. I don't even know if it's funny, but we saw The Protégé this weekend. That's like a blockbuster movie that's out now that people may have seen. And there's still a... still make those? I think so. Blockbusters? I... <laughs> yeah, I knew you were going to say that. What's wrong with... Oh, you mean because the, like the store that went out of business? What yeah, are we talking about? Yeah. Is it another I mean, reference? I have to the Daniel, movies it's... in like a year and a half. <laughs> <laughs> Continue with your story. It's not even good. I can't even say it now. But anyway, there's a person they're looking for in the movie. First and last name is the exact name of a friend of mine. And so I texted him in the middle of the movie, oh, and I was apology? like, "Dude!" And it was his like his birthday, and I was like, "Dude, they're looking for you know." Th- and his name isn't common, so I was like, "Oh, they're looking for you in this movie. It's crazy." And we we're like talking back and forth, and he's like. We're like, yeah, can't wait for when they find you. It's going to be this, like, super dope moment or whatever. They find him in this movie, and he's, he, he can't it's speak, and he friend. can't hear. He was in, like, an accident. He's just sitting in the corner like that. <laughs> and I texted Luke, and I was like, ah, he's actually dead. <laughs> oh, my so God. We were so sad after we built it up the whole movie that they were looking for this guy that he was just, like, <clears throat> like he's just drooling in the corner because he can't do anything. <laughs> Luke he's is a just, vegetable? Like, and and the guy was like, "That's essentially me in real life." No, no. <laughs> it was. I don't know. Lucas I is not though. a common name. The la- yeah, just the, gave it away. I just yeah, I have to bleep it out now. <laughs> it's the first and last name in the movie it was the same, oh. and we were like, "Oh wow, that's 
coincidence. That was like me yesterday when I went on that Cinderella escorts thing to find the virgin uh, uh, escorts, and then I was like, "Oh my god!" Out of the loop as to why you were on that website, please explain because you can't just say, no. "Yeah, I was on that website yesterday." Yeah, I was on it. Uh, no, Daniel asked me to go on there. <laughs> no, 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 stop no. making me out to be an asshole. I'm not. <laughs> Yeah. I don't know who Tommy Pickles is. You think I'm going to know what Cinderella Escort is? <laughs> you fucking asshole. And then I went on there and one of the girls looked like a girl I knew. And I was like, oh my god. She's not a virgin. She can't be on here. <laughs> <laughs> That's what you were concerned about? <laughs> <laughs> not the fact that it exists. Yeah, so no, I just... You were like, hold I on. Just, she's breaking the, same, the rules. <laughs> I had the same epiphany as you where you're like, oh my god. This looks like a person I know. Don't don't relate this to me. That's not the same relation I had. Yeah, it is. I was not this looking on an name. escort service like, oh, this looks like a friend of mine. I better yeah. warn everybody they're not a virgin. Who knows what could happen? I'm lying. This is actually a story Daniel told me. Would and I'm just sh- saying it so that he's not embarrassed. Stop <laughs> gaslighting me. I'm canceled. I'm done. We're done. It's over. It's over. It's over. I've got nothing else to say now. Mm-hmm. <laughs> How was your experience going to a bar last night? Uh, yeah, it was the first time we'd gone to those bars since college because it was like thirty minutes away. Uh, yeah, it was it was Is a bar. bar. I don't have any good or bad to say about it. It's it's a bar. <laughs> I bought a beer. <laughs> I got bored. I bought a beer. <laughs> you drank. Ew. <laughs> you drank. <laughs> the the power of Christ compels you. No. Um, I don't know. I was. Did you take I, a I don't know. Tea and see the devil. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I started smoking the devil's parsley. See. Mm-hmm. <laughs> devil's pubic hair. Mm-hmm. Oh. Yeah. What? <laughs> You've never. What's that, that supposed to be? No. You've never heard. Yeah. No. Yeah. Isn't that what, what everyone calls it? That's what no. I call it. No. Is it really? Yeah, better than parsley. Are you kidding me? <laughs> well, parsley was say a joke. That, it's like an say old Say something person. that people will go like, oh, parsley <laughs> is like, okay. <laughs> Doesn't that taste like soap to some people? Or is that, that cilantro? Pubic hair? <laughs> Get off this topic, man. <laughs> That's unfortunate. <laughs> I don't like this at all. <laughs> Are you one of those white people who it tastes like soap, Daniel? Who what? Pubes. What the fuck are we talking about? What did you just say? If you eat cilantro, does it taste like soap? I don't know why she's talking about pubes, but if Who you eat cilantro... Who the fuck eats cilantro? You don't eat cilantro? Does this mean something? Am Have you I... ever had, like, a taco in your life? Yeah. Cilantro's like the, 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 the leaf shit that doesn't taste like anything. They put on there for, like, decoration, right? They put on, like, rice and no. shit? It no, it has a it has a cilantro distinct like a flavor? spice. I don't fucking know. I'm not a fucking. I'm not Gordon Ramsay. Are you talking about like a garden? Dude, Daniel has COVID. <laughs> oh no, he can't taste. It tastes like nothing. Am I having a stroke? What are we talking about? Cilantro has a distinct taste, so and if you how do we certain... get on cilantro? Because, because I said we, it you like brought up devil's you parsley. You brought up parsley, and I thought it was a thing where it tastes like soap to people. But, but that's that was cilantro, cilantro, and now we're talking about cilantro. Do you? Pay can attention. you taste it? Like soap, or do you taste it like a like a? I don't think I've ever tasted cilantro, thing. so I don't well, know. I don't. I've never you. had cilantro, or if I have, it hasn't tasted like soap. Well, then you got the good. Well, gene. then you don't have it. Don't have what? There's a certain gene that makes it taste like soap. Oh, is that a good gene or bad gene? Are you supposed it's a to bad gene? <laughs> the only thing because then it tastes soap. like soap. <laughs> Is that bad? Well, it might be. It might I love be a eating good soap. Gene. <laughs> what I do? It might be a good gene. I don't know. Daniel's in the shower, like, washing his face. He's like... <laughs> I'm to wash everything. <laughs> What's wrong with eating soap? Uh, <laughs> Have you ever used, like, a friend's shower, soap? and then, like, you see their soap bar, and it's just, like, a complete wad of hair? <laughs> what are you talking about? A friend's shower? You've never friend's, used, like, a, a friend's, friend's shower. Oh, I think I said a French shower. A French shower. French I was shower. Like, yeah, so they're French hairy. People just they're hairy. Those <laughs> dumbass French showers. They got the pubic hair all over. It's disgusting. Those stupid ass French. Yeah, and then I'm like, can you I use the shower? You want to use my shower with the hair on it? Uh, yeah. No. <laughs> Idiot. I'm like, can I use your shower? And then you go in there and they only have, like, a bar of soap. And it's like, I don't want to use your bar of soap that you clearly rub in areas i don't that's gross do you not bring soap to people's houses you stay at 
No. I, she doesn't I even just... stay at their houses. It's just like a party. And she's like, can I go shower? Yeah, can I go shower real quick? <laughs> kind of you boring. don't do I'm that? Shower. And I'm in the back of the party like, I brought my soap. You want, you want some soap? <laughs> I'm just like you need shampoo. <laughs> you need shampoo. I got you, bro. I got you, bro. I'm like a drug dealer, but I'm dealing out like little vacation bottles of shampoo yeah. to <laughs> at parties, like the weirdest place for it. They're like, oh my gosh, it's so hot in here. I'm sweating. You want you want some shampoo? We can just do you shower, need a shower? Right around the corner. Do you, you need want to shower? shower with me? I got a shower right out back. All you gotta do is go out back. There's a shower. You Ten dollars for every five minutes. Oh golly! <laughs> Have you guys ever talked to somebody when you're like, "Oh, I'm gonna go shower," and then they're like, "Without me." Yeah, I'm a guy. So yeah, yeah I, I, I hate I'm your uncle. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I love how you laugh, but when I made that joke, you're like, ah, like, Nick, <gasps> tasteless. Oh, gross. <laughs> you kept going. You said something no, else. No, no, yes, I said did. one joke. <laughs> Bring it um, back. <laughs> roll it back. <laughs> Show the footage. A instant replay. I'm still thinking about the damn French. <laughs> you ever been to a French shower and you go in there and they got the stupid baguettes in the shower? Yes. I'm just rubbing a baguette on your pits. It's yeah. just peeling. It's gross. What is with that? Our one this is Daniel French Sandler. Patreon member. <laughs> there is somebody. There's there somebody like, from France. So que bleu. This is These morons. <laughs> My showers are not dirty. You are dirty. Yeah. <laughs> Quick story, because now I'm thinking about it since we were talking about the group chat. So Angie, for anyone who doesn't know Angie, is the nicest human being on the planet. And she was Confirmed wearing a... Us? Yeah, and be- I'm dumb, and I, I'm in, I, like, I don't know, my humor is not funny. So she's yes. she takes a picture of herself that's on her story, and any time that someone has a shirt that's backwards, I always comment on their story what that word is backwards, because I'm an idiot. So she was wearing funny. a nap. So she was, I know, I'm hilarious, right? <laughs> it's, it's, yeah. So she was wearing a NASA shirt, but it was backwards, so I put A-S-A-N. I was like, Asan, and then as a joke, I messaged her back, and I was like, just to clarify, that says, that's NASA backwards, not me shouting Asian at you. <laughs> it looked like that, right? Because it's oh my ASAN. God. I said that back as a joke. Like, that's, You're that's a bad not... person. And she was like, oh, that makes so much more sense. <laughs> I was like, Angie! I was like, you Asian. actually you actually thought I was just like, Asian! And it was like, Asian! I didn't know you were. It's like, Andy, you actually thought I was just shouting Asian at you. She's like, well, you're so nice. You would never say that. So if you said it, it must be about something else. And I was like, Angie. I used to be the guy that's like, I would hear. Uh, uh, so, that was you like, with Filthy Frank. I would, I would hear songs in real life and be like, oh, that's the song from this movie. And my, my parents would be like, no, son. That's like an actual song. They use the song of that movie. Like the, that's that. that's the way, uh-huh, uh-huh, we like it. What song is that? You know that song? That's what movie way, uh-huh, was that from? Uh-huh. I heard that song and I was like, oh, this is a song from Night at Museum 2. <laughs> <laughs> the original song. And my dad was like, no, son, no. That's that's not from that's Night from at Museum 80s. 2. That's from the 80s. That's not from the 2010 classic Night at Museum 2 <laughs> with an Academy Award nominee, Ben Stiller. That's an actual song, son. I used to do that with all the songs from Shrek. That's what I, I did it with but Shrek But see, that's too. like a joke. You I did it with Shrek too. No, like legit. When I was like, oh, I'm okay. like, man, they made bops and bangers yes, for Shrek. I have, I have the first two Shrek like albums, right? The, the soundtracks for the first two movies. They There's were a great. I was the second one. Yeah, they have oh. "Live in La Vida Loca" in it. Oh, okay. Well, I'm 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 serious about those films. Okay, I'm. Wait, I, Daniel, are you telling me you've watched Annette before you've watched Shrek Two? I watched Shrek Two a long time ago. Okay, Let me tell you, God. the soundtrack okay. is thank- not what sticks oh, in my head. Thank God. Thank okay. God. That's the one where Charming is like Charming and his mom, right? Are doing things. That's the, sounds the fairy gross. woman. Sorry, I, it, that sounds disgusting. Didn't mean it like that. Why would your mind go there? Because, I don't know, you didn't specify you're just charming Ms. Mommy. You've seen things. Shrek 2. You know that's not what happens. <laughs> yeah, but, like, they right? kind of have a weird yeah, relationship. this film is really weird. <laughs> Which Shrek 2 did you watch? <laughs> I downloaded it off some site, and it was really, it was live I'm action. You, I I was obsessed with the Shrek films. Like, when I would hear those songs, I was like, those were, like, my favorite songs. Like, I'd be listening to, like, uh... And any song in that movie, and I'd be like, "This is for Shrek." Not name one. Yeah, I was, I was, <laughs> can't name one. I was gonna, Hallelujah! They were so good. Name one. Yeah, I was like, "Oh, the Shrek song." You hear like "Hallelujah" at choir on Christmas. You're like, "Oh, that's the Shrek song." That's the Shrek song. <laughs> <laughs> 
Did, did, a guy did serenaded Shrek me with that church? song one time. <laughs> did Smash Mouth not make any songs unique for Shrek? Were they all like already done? I feel like I, they I, might I thought have they, I thought one. some of them were new for that. But they maybe might not. have made a few, but they, All I Star was definitely from All the Star, 90s. All Star was, uh, yeah, that was that was my shit. <laughs> I used to watch Shrek every night to fall asleep when I was a kid. Like that was like how I relaxed myself was watching Shrek. So I'm serious uh, the about Scottish that. Ogre, Just imagine her slowly becoming me. limper in her seat. Just hey, now you're an Ostag. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like, oh, I'm so relaxed. Yeah. <laughs> it was. That was my jam. And then like when my dog died, I was like, all right, this is gonna be my comfort movie. That just came out of left fucking field. Damn. <laughs> It's my comfort film. I used to Shrek. watch Shrek every night to fall asleep, and then my dog died. And after yeah. that, I was never the same. I was never the same. Damn, which dog? What are we talking about? This isn't the, the current dog. With... Yeah, it's the current dog. I wish. <laughs> <I'm just kidding. laughs> oh, God. My poor baby. It. Oh, whatever. Oh, my. He eats nails. I'm just kidding. I'm not kidding. Thanks, a psychopath. <laughs> <laughs> You're bad. You hate animals. You hate puppies. <laughs> No, I'm not a psychopath. I love how problem. the first pitch to this had a clip where Daniel says, fuck that dog twice within the <laughs> first minute. <laughs> he really does. It's, it catches the attention. Mm-hmm. It's the attention mm-hmm. getter. Is, like in school, it? when you get the right papers, and they're like, put a hook in there. That's what my hook was. It hooks people in. <laughs> fuck that dog. Thank you for coming to my persuasive paper about mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> why communism is wrong. You don't like communism? Commie, the dirty red commies. <laughs> I don't know if I need to cut that or not. Is that offensive? <laughs> like, is, that, is that bad? Okay, you know what? I have a friend who's like a diehard communist. He, he refers to himself as a commie. Okay. He's so they were the they were the mommy squad, and uh, he was like, "I'm rolling with the mommies. I'm a motherfucking commie." <laughs> He's also a SoundCloud rapper. <laughs> But, um, of course he is. Of course a communist is a SoundCloud rapper. Wow, wow. See? You're going to offend him now. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> That's the point of what I was saying. Yeah, how dare you offend we the one commun- guy who's part of the mommy squad. How dare, I, form- how dare, how dare I speak against the mommy squad communist <laughs> SoundCloud rapper. <laughs> yeah. Golly. If you couldn't tell, they were a bunch of really cool band kids. So. <laughs> of course they are. I can't yeah. imagine why. God, yeah, one man. of them, one of them, uh, this, this same guy, his mother was a teacher at our school, and my brother had him for, had her for English, and one time when he was in class, because they really didn't do anything in her class, they were all just effing around the whole time, and uh, he was trying to stream something on his computer, and then it was one of those kind of sketchy websites where there's a bunch of, like, big titty girls and, like, anime hentai kind of drawings on the side and a, a big wouldn't pop- know i'm a nice little virgin boy sorry that did not mean to draw that long <laughs> of a silence after that continue <laughs> no reaction at all usually you keep talking so I, just, I thought that was gonna be in the background i purposely stopped, stopped talking so all, just so we could all sit on that and be like that was the dumbest fucking thing you ever said let it let it set in okay that's let him nice, marinate. Daniel. Yeah, let, let, him marinate. It. let him marinate how fucking dumb you are. Mm, yeah. Take a couple more minutes think just about to it. render. Just think about it for a second. Two minutes of silence. <laughs> I'm just sitting here crying in the corner. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> anyway. You're happy about that comment. So he's looking at a sketchy site. Yeah, yeah. So he's trying to stream... A, a, a sports game and uh, a of course pop he is. up. Yeah, a pop up comes up and it was like a hentai ad. And the teacher comes by the second that pops up and she's like, "Can we please not do that at school? Please, please do that on your own personal time." So she basically just thought he was a freak the rest of the school year. <laughs> <laughs> and in the middle of class, she would play her son's SoundCloud song, the one that, like, went viral for being in the background of meme compilations. She's like, check this out, kids. The teacher? Yeah, the teacher. What was she a teacher? Like, what class for? English. Oh. (laughs) That really fits into English well. (laughs) Yes. Speaking of English, listen to my son's SoundCloud song. Yeah. She was like, check this out. He raps about being a communist. Oh. Oh, wait, wait. It was the mommy squad guy? Yeah, it's that guy. Wait, I thought you said the teacher <laughs> came by and told the student, stop and do that on your own time. So the mom was saying that to her son? No, the mom said it to my brother 
for watching uh, hentai on his computer. Oh, it was your brother. brother. But instead, but she was like, she was like, she was like, stop watching hentai and listen. Turned it off and listen to my son. Yes, that's exactly (laughs) what she did. (laughs) Turn off that hentai and listen to my son rap. Yes, that's the next T-shirt. Yeah, it is. I think I've sent you guys the song before. It's it's great. Send it again. Send it again. Have I told you guys this story? So in our high school. for our one one year, we had a teacher. He was in there for like one year, and he was a complete hippie. He had super long hair. Uh, they dressed like hippies. He showed us a, the first day. He showed us a giant aerial view of his backyard of, of just so many plants, everything. And he, there was one particular sort of area he didn't reference at all. He told us about every single plant except the one that looked like weed. And we were like, huh. All right. And then he was like, I'm going to skip over that one. And we're just going to skip over that one anyway. No this one guy me sleep. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> this dumbass thought it'd be a good idea to uh, let us watch 1984. And have you read that book? The George I Orwell know. book? I know so, of it. Mm-hmm. To refresh anyone's mind, never read this oh, book. Boy. The first third is like totalitarianism, like it's kind of interesting. The next two thirds are dusty old people having sex, and it's yep. disgusting. With I don't understand the book. I don't know why nice. it's a classic. I don't know why they make us read it when we're 16 years old, but... Fuck me. I guess they'd let us... Whatever. It's the same reason why they make us watch uh, or listen to... (laughs) Read Lolita, the one with the freaking 12-year-old girl getting banged by like a 35-year-old guy. Right. That one's like a classic. I've never heard of that one. I don't even know what that is. What school were you in? They they make high schoolers read that. I think you just read that. (laughs) I'm I'm an IRL lolly, okay? Theater kid. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah, anyway. But... <laughs> anyway, so our teacher thought it'd be a good idea. So we read this book, right? And he's like, "Well, let's let's watch the movie." Huh? And it's, the movie's, of course, rated. He pulled the DVD. He's got the DVD already. It's rated R. What's it rated nice. R for? Nudity and graphic, sexual. You know. So he's like, okay. "We'll be able to skip it. It's not going to sneak up on us, right?" And so we we put it in. We're all like, "Oh, fuck!" And the first one, he almost doesn't catch, even though it couldn't have been set up more perfectly. She's running up the hill in slow motion, like getting ready to rip off her jacket. And it's all built, the volume in the class like builds. We're like, all right, okay, skip, skip. Okay, skip. yep, it's please, getting there. Okay, please. what's, is he going to skip it? And then he's like, oh, oh, and he gets it just in time. We're like, okay, good save. Next time, though, you guys there was no saving it. to see the boobs? <laughs> high so please, are you. please. Yeah, we were like, skip it. Skip it. Yeah, Wink. skip it. Wink. Uh, <laughs> now, these people were old and no. Anyway, mm-hmm. so uh, the next scene, there was no saving it. It was just one frame. It was a meadow. Next frame, buck naked, everybody, and just full on. It was not like R-rated where they try to hide things. It was full on. And we, everyone's like, oh, okay. Oh, and he goes, oh, and he freaks out. And he starts smashing the shit out of his keyboard, which doesn't work. And so he, it's a projector. He runs and jumps in front of it to cover it up. But it's a projector, and he's a dumbass. So it just projects the old boobs on him. So we look up, and it's just boobs on him now. And we're like, oh, oh, oh it's so much worse. And so then we blackmailed him the rest of the year, and we didn't have to write any more papers. We made his wife bring him cookies. I'm not an asshole, though. (laughs) There was a teacher. Totally are. You didn't have to tell us the last part. And now you're like, yeah, we blackmailed him. I'm just kidding. We We didn't actually do that, but he thought he needed Uh to do that for us. Uh Mm -hmm. Like, as soon Uh as he he had his head on his desk for like two minutes of silence, and then he looks up and he's like, okay, no test next Friday. And we were like, Oh, okay. You're, you're oh. The and the next deeper. week he'd bring in cookies for no reason. We were like, okay. okay. Oh, no reason. Not yeah, for no yeah. reason. Well, he okay. just kept, he thought it was a huge, super big deal. And he thought he needed to like quiet everybody from saying it. Well, someone told on him anyway. This and what is was because hilarious you lived in a small town in the Bible. Yeah. Bowl. Well, somebody told the professor <laughs> or someone told the, the vice principal, like the, the big guy. And they big were like, guy. This guy showed us nudity. And he's like, well, you were bound to see it sooner or later, kid. And that was the end <laughs> of that conversation. <laughs> he's like, you bunch of virgins. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, epic moment. I love this guy. He's hilarious. That was I had a it. teacher in middle school. One time he tried to project something up on the smart board like that as well. And he accidentally didn't like switch the tabs in time. And he just had straight up like porn where it was like, oh. you know, it says like teenage on it. And yeah, 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 and everybody was like thoroughly disgusted. Did and you then get fired, I hope. No, no. And then okay, I remember well. the same day I was walking past his classroom, and he'd like to like stand out and watch the kids in the hallway and like yell at them if they were like holding hands or like you know walking by. And so he'd just stand there and watch them. And his pants, He's his jealous. his fly oh, was completely up. down. His fly was completely down, and, like, his shirt was tucked into it, so it was, like, a, just a big, like, 
dong looking thing hanging out of his pants and i was like oh my god please don't actually be his dong and then i was like oh it's a shirt um, oh yeah that makes it okay that a grown man is standing in the hallway watching kids with this fly down I don't know. yeah well it it wasn't the peen we also had a gym teacher if anybody you know went to my That's my the middle story school. you, you we guys also will had a know gym teacher you guys will know who he is mr lingen felter he was he was very interesting yeah he was um he was very creepy uh all the time when they would send a slip like calling a student down um to go to the office or whatever it was like if the person delivering it was a male student he'd have to go into the boys locker room and give it to the guy teacher because he can't go into the girls locker room so mr lingenfelter just would bust into the girls locker room while we're all changing with the slip and was like hey Susie q needs to go down to the office and there's just like middle schoolers in their bras and underwear like he was so creepy he would he would watch the girls volleyball team uh, after yeah. after class like after school even though he wasn't the coach he would just stay yeah. and watch them uh, i remember no stop this <laughs> okay, I'm, I'll, I'm done talking about him. Let's but go get I some go vengeance. I got a baseball bat in the trunk, right? Let's... Yeah, I was like, we I had a similar situation at our school. Him. He was suspended like... for being a creep eventually. Good. He came back. Oh, I have more creepy stories about him. He was a freaking weirdo. Yeah, we yeah? had a we had a gym teacher at our it's school. It's always gym teachers, huh? It's always gym teachers. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, the way, I don't know how your locker room was, but our locker room, it was the lockers, and then there's, like, an office in the back for, like, yeah. the gym teacher, mm-hmm. and they had, like, this big for, window. For you audience can, viewing. <laughs> yeah, yes. Can, literally what it was for him, because yeah. he would sit in his room and just, like, watch the kids as they change, and people were kind of creeped out by that, but they were like, oh, well, what can you do? So, time passes forward, and then one time, he didn't come out in time. And someone went back to, like, call him out because the class was just sitting there, like, waiting for Jim. And he had full-on porn just on the, the classroom TV. Oh, boy. And he was just watching it. And he got mad that someone came in. And He got mad. School... Oh. Yeah, he got mad. You're not supposed to come here. And uh, the school fired him. Good. And then, good. miraculously, after two years, he came back. <sighs> miraculously. <laughs> this is how it happens. This is what happens nowadays. There, I genuinely guarantee there are people whose jobs are to turn like cancel culture into algorithms and numbers to know okay you've got this many followers it's this level of how bad it is work so someone plugs in all the numbers and they're like we're gonna wait we're gonna wait this out for eight months and then by the time eight months come out you're gonna be you're gonna be fine everyone's gonna forget about it literally that's what happens now everybody that's canceled for doing something horrible they're gonna come back in a year it's gonna be completely fine no one's gonna give a shit anymore and it drives me insane Cuomo, I like guarantee he's gonna run for the next election. Probably gonna win. Like that's just the way it is. Probably gonna win. Probably Jesus. gonna win. His saggy it's like ass fucking CK, face. Right? Is he's what? back. Like yeah, exactly. CK, he's I don't back. understand any of that stuff. I mean, it's just uh, it's gross. It's bad. Thankfully, we didn't have any teachers like that. Our gym teacher was a uh, the coolest guy ever. He was like he was nice, but he was also like super stern. So we liked him, and he ran an Iron Man in every single state in the U.S. It's like, there's not much more of a flex than that. <laughs> so I don't know what that is, com- so it's like a not, like a big deal for me. Oh, oh it's like a marathon? <laughs> Iron Man's okay. like, like the, the gold standard like marathon. the superhero? <laughs> <laughs> he just runs around. He was Iron like Man in every state. <laughs> well, like, it yeah. sounds kind of like a loser. Yeah. <laughs> just a grown man in a costume at conventions. <laughs> yeah, dude, look at my suit. <laughs> look at my suit. He went to Iron Man conventions in every state. Yeah, guys, look at my suit. <laughs> I'm like Tony Stark. <laughs> I mean, he was the only one in Alaska at the Alaskan convention. <laughs> hey, guys, you just hear my Iron Man suit. What a cool guy. <laughs> no, so the Iron Man's like a gold standard, like, marathon, uh, like, one of the top kinds of, mar- I don't know all the different marathons there are, but that's like the name, the name brand one. I think it's like 23 miles running. Something like that. Something like that. So he did one in I every state, and he was run. like 70. It was insane. He did Healthy all that. Healthy man. Why'd you say it like that? <laughs> Healthy man. Healthy man. I got good legs. Got good legs. I hated my gym good teacher. Ace. Like when I was in middle school, <laughs> I wore I wore a freaking full body like brace. So like I didn't have complete mobility and we'd have to do warm ups every day. We'd have to do like crunches. And I remember I couldn't do like full crunches because it it would keep my back straight, so I literally couldn't bend it, like, forward or back. So, like, he would yell at me, and he'd be like, come on, do it! What is wrong with you? Like, and I was like, I can't, like, and 
I was like, I literally can't. Just straining and it's crying and awful. smiling at the same yeah. time. It's, it's like all those. It's like all those movies where like they look back on the on the woman's like past and they have like a fit, like a giant denture brace thing on. That's like exactly what you went through. Yeah, all those scenes was, are based off your life. To, I was supposed to have the headgear like that, like the one that's like the horse muzzle type thing yeah. around the head. But of I told course. you, I had. I, <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? Arms like that. I yeah, the saw I, one. We yeah. talked about this. Yeah, yeah. But they tested the new gear on you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm. I'm chilling now. You're so cool, dude. I'm so cute. I had so many body deformities. <laughs> <laughs> this is how she does the speed dating. This is how the conversations yeah. go. I'm not like the other girls. Literally, I'm, I'm deformed. deformed. <laughs> <laughs> she waits a pause, though. She's like, I'm not like the other girls. I'm deformed in like four places. <laughs> Find out which ones. Find out which ones. And she's sitting like this. She's like, find out later. You'll never guess. You'll, ne- you'll never guess. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. I'm so sorry. You're mean. <laughs> Stop. I'm not mean. I'm just making fun of your deformity. not me. I'm just making fun of your blind orphan dog. Fuck. Yeah. What's wrong with you? Damn it. It's okay. I'm fully functional. It's okay. I'm not anymore. I'm Wait. getting my deformities now. That now I can't like run or do anything. I can't bike anymore. I have to do like the old recumbent people biking. It's That's sad. Fun. I can't so, ride yeah. a bike. I don't you have can't ride a bike. No. <laughs> Why don't you have the balance? Like you were like you were like oh we should go on a bike trip one time it was super pretty and I was like yeah 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 <laughs> <laughs> that one time you talked about. <laughs> When's the last time you tried being on a bike? Like two years ago. How'd that go? F- fail a lot. <laughs> so you actually Genuinely can't like. How fast did balance? you go? I have like terrible balance. I I like in my regular everyday life I fall all the time. Like I don't know. It's sad. <laughs> Wait, you like just randomly fall? You're just holding there with like a glass of bottle, and you're just like, oh well, there we go again. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I just I'm just kind of like. Can whoop. I buy you a walker? <laughs> <laughs> It's less about balance, though, and more just about getting up to the speed where it, like, carries itself. Yeah, that's you know? what like, That's how you can saying. bike without, like, hands on the handrail. Yeah, my brother's like, you just need to speed it up. And I'm like, I can't do it. And then I'm like, Pfft. and I just fall away. Oh, <laughs> yeah, like, I was oh, using no. a, a family, yeah, I was using a family friend's bike, like, in front of her house, and I was just trying to ride it. And then one of her neighbors came out and saw me struggling and was like, would you like my daughter's helmet? She doesn't live here anymore. And uh, this was her childhood helmet, and it looks like it would fit you because you're a child. And I was like, oh, I'm actually an adult, but... (laughs) My daughter died ten years ago on a scary day from the bike accident that took her life. Have her helmet. (laughs) Thank you. I think that guy actually lost the custody battle on this child. So, you didn't have to bring that. Yeah. I was okay with Sorry. that. I was like, oh, what a I sweet was okay man. With that. Like, he was a sweet guy. Yeah. Now I mean again. <laughs> what do you know? Sorry. I can't just tell a happy story and they don't no. happen to me. There are bikes like that though, so it's not just you. The there are some, the really nice bikes have like special shoes so you can click in and you're like you're using like all the energy, you're not wasting any energy, you know. But like you have to click out it's of like it a when you stop. Stationary bike. Yeah, it's kind of terrifying. Well, no, like your 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 shoes have a little thing on it that clicks into the pedal, so that way your foot's also pulling up the pedal. It's not just pushing down, you know. So it's you're supposed to use more energy. You're less tired, but to when you come to a stop sign, you have to do a special move to like unclick you your foot. You have to do a flip. Yes, that. <laughs> but like, so my friend had just gotten one of these, and like you forget about it. So you like you pull up to a stop sign. There's a couple times where like you just forget to unclick your foot, and then you it's too late. And he's like, oh, oh shit, <laughs> you just fall. <laughs> Straight over on your side. There's nothing you can do about it. Yeah, that's how I look when I ride a bike. I'm like, I'll pass on that so that I'll just I'll just waste my energy. At least I won't fall. Yeah. Fine See, when me. I was a kid, my friends always used to be like, you're like Phoebe from Friends. And I didn't watch Friends, but they're like, she can't ride a bike. You're, you really you're just are. like her. She's so she's so goofy. You're, you're just like her. And I'm like, couldn't, couldn't tell you. But every, sure. every white girl talks about friends in the Midwest. So I dated a girl who had a friends tattoo. I just wanted to put that out oh, there. Nice. <laughs> well, <laughs> well, it was the worst date I've ever been on the West That's in my head. Oh, you're doing the intro? Thanks a lot. All I know is the... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm glad we can get that all out of the way. 
<laughs> now Phoebe was the Phoebe was the funniest, but she was also like so if you haven't seen Friends, she's hilarious, but also like they make her story so sad for no reason. Everyone else is normal and she like All relatable. What is it? She like yeah, she's got a sister that like steals her identity and doesn't want to be around her. Her parents died and she was like she was on the streets for a while like begging for food and like stealing st- like I mean Wait, what? I thought this was like a quirky show about like You would think that. And they have like a turkey on their head. <laughs> <laughs> she will always just bring up something completely dark and it's funny but you're like fuck that's dark uh, that's i guess her, i am like that's her for nine years she's just like oh yeah i did that when i was begging on the street for food <laughs> and you're like oh my gosh i know she does uh, the smelly cat right she does oh that. it's something yeah i don't know enough of the <laughs> and stuff but i've seen them i've seen all of them at some point yeah i've i've seen a couple episodes of it my best friend was like super into that show when we were younger so i remember when i'd go to sleep over she'd just play it at night and she'd fall asleep like in the first episode and i i have trouble sleeping so i would just be staring at this show and like it's in the middle of a season and i have no idea who these characters are and i'm like mm-hmm. i see that they were on a break i get <laughs> it <laughs> <laughs> I feel like everyone i knew was talking about it so i was like okay i'll watch it before it gets off netflix and then by the time i finished it no one was talking about it again. I was like, fuck oh, me. I just watched oh, nine man. seasons or ten, whatever nine there Nine seasons of that? Is there ten? I think there's ten or nine, yeah. Oh, man. A lot See, of that's, episodes. that's why you don't do stuff to fit in, Daniel. Yep, that's go, why. Go with that's... the flow. Don't, don't do your own I thing. I was trying to go with the flow. It didn't <laughs> yeah. work. That's do your awful. own thing. There, I like three. What's I already forget everybody's names. Matthew Perry is my favorite, though. Chandler. Because he's, he's exactly my sense of humor. He's, he was definitely the funniest, in my opinion. Him and Phoebe. And then... I can't watch that show. It's that. just genuinely unbearable to it's me. It's just like the laugh track is insanely loud. <laughs> oh, you guys are getting married? Whoa! And it's just like, they, they're holding hands. It's it's so bad to me. I can't. Dude. I genuinely cannot. I'll I, watch it if it's on, like, in a doctor's office, but I can't do it. It's Any, any part with Chandler and Phoebe is genuinely laugh out loud and then everyone else uh, joey's pretty everyone funny, else is like how you doing awful ross monica and rachel i fucking hate them they're not funny it's not them as actors and actresses it's just the stuff they have them do it's just ross is insane monica's insane and who's the other one i already forgot rachel's just rachel. annoying the whole time i i don't but get she's it, hot but... Ugh, oh no 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 <laughs> Yeah, she's like a quintessential 90s character. My mom had the Rachel haircut in the 90s. Everyone had the Rachel haircut in the 90s. I didn't. Well, you know what? Yeah, I didn't either. I didn't. I wasn't alive. (laughs) Oh, thank you. Yeah, I was like, I was alive. (laughs) I was like, I had. Yeah, I was going to say, I had the late 90s. The late 90s. You have a what? I said I had pigtails. That was like my my hairstyle in the 90s. (laughs) Nice. 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 (laughs) Nice. I've met. I've never had a hairstyle. I've just never known what to do with my hair ever. That's. A I guess guys don't really. Yeah, I was gonna say you. You can color it. You can do nice. some funky stuff. I you wish I could be that person where up. my hair could just fall like wherever it is and be fine. But like, you have to. It's not it? how it is at all. I have to do stuff to it or else it doesn't work. Like if I wait, I could, as I wake up and it'll like fold itself. And you can't go anywhere until you wash your hair because it looks awful. I, I hate it. No, most of my guy hair. friends do like the, like just brush it like three times with their fingers and then like head I out wish. the door. I wish. <laughs> like they're like, hold on, I have to get ready. And then they're like, and then, yeah, and then they're like, all right. <laughs> like they don't own back. a hairbrush. Like, nice. Nice. <laughs> it's crazy. I've had the same hairbrush for nine years. <laughs> My, my hair, <laughs> my fingers. <laughs> and before that, don't ask. Don't ask. Oh. What I use? My mother's fingers. Oh. My mother's ah. fingers. <laughs> She's my, dead. Hair, <laughs> my hair is so thick that I like break through hair. I used her like, fingers after spikes. she died. See. <laughs> oh, gross. <laughs> Just has the hand. Just the hand broken off. <laughs> yeah, only the hand. That seems like something like the Adams family would do. <laughs> Children's show throwback. Guess what else I didn't see? Adam's Family. Hey. You didn't watch that? I didn't love watch anything, too. Juliana. Wait, 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 wait. Which one are you referencing? Which know. one am I referencing? The show, the movies, the animated movie, the animated series. The animated series. Nick's, I think Nick's I got all down here. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say, You're referencing I the 1984 the play. The animated series, and I saw the live action movie. 
the new not... live or the new the new oh, animated no. movie no, hilarious not the new no. animated movie i didn't see that oh is it bad i didn't i, I didn't, didn't see it, it cuz i'm not a child but they stacked you the watch shit children's out of... movies all the time i see no i reviews. don't like what like what Luca. you just watch like a lin manuel movie like 1 second ago Oh, I could make an entire compilation of Lou and Mel Miranda screaming. <laughs> Those are that's new movies though, and that's a musical. It's different. No, not not the musical. And Luke is a Pixar about... movie. You're gonna watch Pixar movies. Okay, well then that Get those are technically children's dick. movies. So fine, so... whatever. I'm a child. Okay, move on. There's my child brain, my children this. brain can't handle a net. I'm gonna go back to <laughs> go back to Shrek Forever After. Don't call it. They're making another one, aren't they? I thought there was already five. There's, there's another Shrek movie? Not. There's a new coming Shrek soon. movie coming out. Oh my gosh. Yeah. And if the marketing is going to take care of itself, because the internet's going to blow up with fucking memes, and you got to... I mean, someone in the room was like, we could make so much fucking money off another one of these. That's uh, so sad. It's like the same genius. thing with the Minions. They just keep Yeah, but the Minions were never it. good. Yeah, but... I mean, I, mean, I like adult, Despicable I'm Me. I'm pretty sure babies like the Minions. <laughs> Yeah, and as long- an adult, you can't be like, yeah, he just said banana. I don't get it. Like, <laughs> it's fine. It's targeted for kids. Beepity boop literally- boop. What the fuck? <laughs> Dumbass literally- little shit. You're like, that's not funny. Why are the kids even laughing? Is this I what really has come to nowadays. I really like the first two Despicable Me's. I really like those. Those are good. Yeah, not seeing the Minion movie. I'll pass on that. I saw the Minion movie. How Me and my it? brother watched it as a joke. Um, nice. It wasn't good, but it was better than I was expecting it to be. <laughs> if that go. tells you anything. I mean, you know, they're not speaking English most of it. They're not speaking any language. That sounds but... enjoyable. I don't know yeah. why I would not like that yeah. as a grown adult. <laughs> yeah. Can you imagine the whole movie's like, okay, and action. They're like, and yeah. cut. We're just going to repeat that for an hour. Yeah, that's like <laughs> nice my job. That's funny. <laughs> that's funny. You guys, you guys like playing Sims as kids? That was like, I thought I that was the played. funniest stuff when I was a kid. Like, they would have like music and it was like, Simlish. Doba, Goobo, Wish Up. And then it was like, Don't You Wish Your Girlfriend Was Hot Like Me, but like in, in Simlish. Katy Perry recorded like, like a cover of uh, Friday in Simlish. I don't know if you remember See, that. See, I thought, I thought that was so funny. A Friday? Was a or, or what's her name? Or TGIF. What's the song called? Yeah. Rebecca uh, Black did Friday. Last no, Friday no, no. night. Yeah, that song. Yeah, we gooby globby glob. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> she literally recorded one like that. <laughs> I just I, realized two months ago that Sims stands for simulations. I never I got that. I, yeah. I guess I. That's never why that. I said like dating sim. I never, I sim. never got to play Sims. If you, I will I say, I played it when I was a kid, and I would just make them bang all day, and then they'd lose their jobs. <laughs> <laughs> So you were simulating real life, essentially. <laughs> well, I was like five. I don't know. Like Fine. I just like, Juliana. Like, like you know, they don't actually like they just show the blank. It's like when and did you get like, the talk like, oh, when you were one? <laughs> I, I had it pretty young. Like, By like, five, she was just like fuck. Yeah, my daycare lady like had it, and then she was like, she was like, don't make him fall in love with like the stoner guy. He's gross. And then I was like, makes them fall in love with every guy. And then I was like, all right, now I'm just doing this so they'll do the wrestling thing in the bed. And then, like, there's all these, you know, there's all these, like, hearts floating around the bed, and I was like, yeah, I'm so good at relationships. <laughs> like, this you translates so well to my real life. <laughs> you never played, like, As a, a five-year-old Sims kind of game or anything like that, Daniel? Like, I remember playing one where it was, like, they would go Don't to the mall, that. and then I would just, like, start hitting on guys there, and it was, like... Uh, then you'd get their phone number and you'd text them and then like sometimes you'd get like a down thing if a guy didn't like what you'd say and then your relationship bar would go down and i'm like no <laughs> wow well, that's me. complex i didn't know it was that complex yeah, every like, two yeah. months you see a video that blows up on tiktok that's like oh the sims were real life and it's a guy with a fucking cube above his head and like blah, 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 and everyone's like it's so real and i'm like we've seen this nine thousand times i will say i did get to play there was because we were behind on this the wave of games there's a there's a Sims spinoff called Sims Carnival. That game fucking slaps. The music, the yeah, game, like, it's so that. good. That was such a good game. We yeah, we I, only I played PC that. games. We had like ten, and we rotated through them as kids. We'd each get thirty minutes on the computer, and we'd be like Carmen San Diego, uh, Sims Carnival, and Nancy Drew. <laughs> Nancy oh Drew God. video game. Dude, the Nancy Drew video game slaps. Don't even disrespect. Is that the my one girl. where you just click around and find stuff? 
No. <laughs> <laughs> totally is, dude. You're like, that game was great. Because I played that game. Yeah. It's good. It's but you can good. fall down the elevator shaft and die. It's great. Oh, great. <laughs> that scared me as a kid. You can actually do that. This game is super PG. You're like walking around hallways and looking at like blood and shit on the floor. And then like you're in an elevator shaft and it's like the arrow lets you go forward. And she's like, and I don't like know if I should. Scare? And you're like, um, go ahead. And she's go like, go ahead, okay. Nancy. I, 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 let me tell you literally how this scene goes. You're on the edge and the, the, the mouse turns into an arrow. So it's like you think as a kid, you're like, oh, I guess you can climb down. I don't know. You can keep going. She's like, I don't think I should. And, <laughs> and you then click you click again. Her? You're like, you click again. She's like, okay. <laughs> and that's getting cuts off. <laughs> Jump it's scene. terrifying. I remember this distinct moment when I was in the library as a kid and she fucking died. And, I was like, and you start screaming really loud in the library. <laughs> the game ends. It goes back to the main menu and it goes back to the calm. like, da, 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 da. And you're like, <laughs> Nancy! 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 No! <laughs> that's hilarious. It's terrifying. My favorite games were like the, the putt-putt games or whatever when I was a kid. He was like the car or whatever. I don't, I don't remember what he was. Oh, the cartoon, like, little blue or purple car. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I used to love Lightning those Lightning McQueen? Games. Yeah, it was Lightning McQueen before Ka-chow. Lightning McQueen. Okay. <laughs> wow. Wow. Putt-Putt Ka-chow. goes to the zoo. Those were great. Those games. Yeah, we didn't get those. Uh, we had, like, probably, yeah, I don't know. We probably only started computer games when I was, like, 10. <laughs> I remember loving the computer. Like I used to buy uh, computer games at like TJ Maxx and stuff like that. I don't know if you guys had <laughs> those over there. <laughs> yeah, but they had like discount computer games, and I was like, oh, these are sick." Cause, you know, it's you're like little. Off-brand. No, I they're all like I PC spy, games. like click and find. Yes, yes. Really? yes. dude. So that's what I would buy, and then I discovered YouTube, and I'm like, "This is better than I Spy." And that was- <laughs> <laughs> YouTube's was banner is better than I Spy. <laughs> no, I used to like that's just type in fart and like spend hours on YouTube watching fart videos. That's what that was my childhood. And then one time I was at my childhood? I was at my aunt's house one time, and she's like, "What are you doing?" And then she just sat in the room with me, and I was so embarrassed. Like I knew, like, oh yeah, yeah this is weird. I so I opened up same. Microsoft Paint, and I'm just like scribbling slowly, like, <laughs> writing drawing. in blood. <laughs> I'm just drawing. <laughs> this is why videos. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say this is how Nick became who he is today. He's an internet boy to this day. <laughs> can you imagine playing a game where you find stuff with your aunt watching you? Oh, I can feel that. I can feel that, dude. We used to have a game like that. It was like a, shoulders. <laughs> it was called Nick's Escape the Museum. Story was fart videos, and mine was like Sims forcing the Sims to have sex. <laughs> Two very, di- and then mine was sitting in a room doing nothing. You were just praying. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not a mean person. Why, why is no one like me? I still no, do that now. I'm not mean. So. <laughs> Nothing's changed. Nothing's changed. There used to be a game that I had on our old computer, like the really, really old computer, and the only it wasn't a game. The only thing you could do was you could change your cursor. You could click the screen. It would like shatter the screen a little bit. And then, or you could make it place ants, and then you could smush them with like a hammer, and then it would just and it would stick on your screen everywhere. I don't know what it was called, but it would stay there unless you like completely exited the game. But it was essentially a virus. You could put it on a flash drive and take it to like. So I took it to the school, and you could do it at the school. I don't know why this is. This is the stuff I thought was fun back in the day. You put it on your teacher's (laughs) computer, and then they're like, "Why can't I get these bugs off my screen?" (laughs) Back in the day, when they started updating Windows, and people didn't know what the fuck they were doing, that was the best. Because as a kid, you could make the whole screen like shift left, you know, (laughs) and the mouse is off, and they have no idea how to change it. IT doesn't know how to change it because everyone's stupid. So they're just teaching the whole class like sideways with the mouse, like, (laughs) "Uh," and then you. That was the best. Although that I was still when they like, were using those projectors where they write on the clear slips. Yeah, on the clear stuff. Oh, I remember Lord. those. The, the Elmo. With a light bulb in there that could start a fire at any moment. Yeah. Those old projectors. Oh, yeah. I love those. And then, like, when we'd get the smart boards, the teachers would always just, like, Let you accidentally, touch the dots. like, yeah, use a Sharpie on it. I remember, like, the first day my teacher had <laughs> oh, it, she yeah. used Sharpie on it. <laughs> and I was like, haven't you used whiteboards? Like, what? <laughs> I don't Ugh. understand. Come on! <laughs> yeah. well, come whiteboard, on. come off! <laughs> I like, even if it was where... a whiteboard, that's what makes that funny, is that even if it was a whiteboard or a blackboard, it, like, Sharpie doesn't go on any of those. That's That was the <laughs> joke. Dumb. Yeah, she just used <laughs> Sharpie, and I was like, why? Remember when we thought smart boards were going to be the future? Big, gigantic, thick-ass fucking smart boards? 
Yes. It so is funny. the future. Shut I up. I thought they were the coolest thing. Nick has one in the background. Um, um, <laughs> recalibrate. <laughs> the first day of class. Now, this was our first day of class in seventh grade. Our teacher made every, like each person in the class do a dot. So it took us 25 fucking minutes to calibrate the fucking smart Sharing board. Sharing is caring. Oh my gosh, it took forever. And we didn't, he didn't tell us what it was. So we just didn't know what it was. We started school and he's like, okay, uh, we're going to start from here. You come up Everybody here, touch push. that dot. It sounded like now a power you... play. So he gets up there and the kid's like, Ugh. He's like, touch the dot, kid. And he like touches the dot and then, okay, next. And everyone goes through and he never explained what it was. And once it, the last dot was pushed, it went away. And he's like, okay, let's start. We were like, what Wait, the fuck you would just do? Boy. We just You're the, the only person I know who complains as a kid, like, I'm not learning, I'm clicking dots. Like, yeah, I love doing other that. Other kids are, like, celebrating, like, yes, less school, and you're like... In less school, I can click on things. This I paid good money for this job. <laughs> That's not what I I'm think, saying. I'm not I saying I was annoyed. I was just saying it was confusing, education. because they didn't tell us why we were doing it. Like, we were just doing it, and he just kept looking at us. It was a really awkward moment. Totally fine remember, not doing anything. I remember, like, I just had, like, a distinctive memory. I'm fun, memory. okay? <laughs> Fuck! I just had a memory pop in my head. Like, I remember after school, my teacher was making me recalibrate it for her, and it was, like, Sean Kingston's Beautiful Girls or whatever was playing in the background, and it was like, your way to beautiful girl. And then, like, they asked me to do it, and I, like, couldn't reach the top buttons because I was so small, and I'm just, like, stressing out to beautiful girls. And I was, like, alone in the room, and I'm like, you got suicidal. Yes, you asked the suicidal. shortest girl in the class to do the calibration yeah. for the dots. <laughs> she can't get the top dot, so they're all, like, two inches low, so nothing yeah. is calibrated at the top. Yes, that's how it was. I would, like, jump. And, like, the calibration was just all shifted down. <laughs> That's so funny. So the board's completely fucked up. Yeah. <laughs> good times. Good times. Yeah, we um, had no good memories. You, you had all the trauma ones. The only traumatic moment trauma. we had. Yep. The only traumatic <laughs> moment we had was we spent all uh, all your growing, uh, uh, like, seeds, uh, bean seeds or something, lima beans, uh, in whatever fucking science class. All the cups were at the window, and then at some point, someone came through a window and knocked everything over, so they all died. So <laughs> that was uh, someone broke in to kill the plants. And no, then, beans. <laughs> no beans. No beans. <laughs> no beans in <this> school. <laughs> I, it's like so different from my elementary school. I remember we came back one weekend, and there was just a bullet hole through our window <laughs> in the classroom. I heard you guys are making beans. I heard you guys are growing beans. <laughs> No beans in this school. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <That's the> teacher. <laughs> Everyone's like, there he is. He's like, you got beans. <laughs> <laughs> Just full on like swan dives into a window to knock him over. One time when my brother was in elementary school, there was this kid who had like a mental breakdown and he started throwing <laughs> chairs like at at other students like actually just throwing them and my brother was the only large kid in the class so the teacher made my brother like detain him like just what? hold him like what? <laughs> just hold him and this the is kid, such a twist from the bean the, thief to the kid was well i remember the window thing he threw he threw a chair through the window that's a long story short so <laughs> Imagine, you can't legally do that, can you? Make the student, you over there, constrain that yeah, child, throwing, chucking like, shit through a window. Yeah, they were like, just hold him. You're the only one strong enough, John, Just a kid, like, it. just a kid palming a shard of glass, and he's like, you there, go give him a big hug. Yeah, yeah, he did. He just hugged him. He just bear hugged him, and then, until, you like, somebody came that. in. Yeah, well, it happened. It's a real story. Jeez. <laughs> Yeah, see, yeah, that's, I, that's trauma. That's what I'm talking about. I now asked my brother if he'd stuff. ever want to... That's trauma. I was like, would you ever want to be on my podcast? Oh my and my brother was like, uh, no, I don't have any good stories. And I was like, you have good stories. And then he's like, like what? And I was like, oh, wait, I've already told like all your good stories. <laughs> <laughs> and then he's like, okay, I'll go on the podcast if we can talk about really controversial, really political, really philosophical things that make people uncomfortable. And I was like, uh. nope. Not a guest for Pass. this show. <laughs> Daniel's too mean. He won't allow it. He won't allow it. And then my friend was like, don't let your brother on there. He's, he's too quiet. 
He'll be he'll be a boring guest. And I was like, oh my gosh, so mean. Why is everybody so mean? Yeah, including myself. So, yeah, including myself. <laughs> okay. Golly. Golly. Golly gee. Dang yep. it. My brother was like, my sense of humor is not like your friends. I'm way too edgy, so I wouldn't be able to be on that that show. Every time he Hitler. speaks, it's... <laughs> All right. he'll just fart into the mic the whole time. <laughs> We're like, what do you got to say about that? Just... You're like, all right, yeah. and that was political. <laughs> Moving on. <laughs> that was too political. Everything else Shut he actually up. says, we have to bleep out like half of it, and then in between the bleeps, you just hear us all going, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> oh my gosh, make it stop. Oh, Nick's getting tired oh, of us. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. He's a. And now a word from our sponsor. Yes. I don't know. What's a sleep <laughs> censored sponsor? Good job. Good jokes. <laughs> yeah, I, I, yeah I, I try to be funny and it doesn't work anymore. I try. Sleep number or whatever that, that is. Purple. Pick your number and that's how you sleep. Do I the ones understand. where um they always do the sponsor and it's like the mattress in the box ones. I always Purple. see those. Purple. Yeah. Yeah. Is a mattress in a box? Or Casper or whatever. Oh, yeah. Casper's the yeah. one. Yeah. <laughs> those ones. They're like, now. You ever mattress? wanted to sleep on a children's ghost? <laughs> Then yeah. buy Casper. <laughs> That's what Casper is, Nick. Don't look at me like that. You've seen Casper the movie, have you not? No. You've not? You haven't? I thought you liked spooky stuff. Oh, sure. I have, but I just, <laughs> now you know how it feels when we ask you if you've seen anything and you're like, no, what is that? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I get That's it. so true. Well, I don't expect you to have seen it, but like, you know who it is. Yeah. I've watched. No. You see, I grew up in the era where I didn't have cable TV, so if I wanted to watch something... I'd have to obtain it VHS. physically via VHS. Too, yeah. Yes. Oh, we didn't have cable cl- either. We didn't a lot have of classic cartoons I have on VHS. I saw VHS, Casper but... two years ago in a pizza hut in Omaha. <laughs> <laughs> in Omaha. <laughs> I didn't see that when I was a kid. You kidding me? You I saw that when I was me? drunk one night alone. <laughs> <laughs> I saw it one wondering. night when I broke into the school. It was playing on the TV. <laughs> Yes. And then I was arrested. Hey, I was going to say, Daniel's just, like, breaking into schools. Like, he just sends us a picture, and he's like, check this out that I wrote on this board at, like, midnight. And I was like, how'd was like you get one into in the a morning. school? I'm yeah, I was like, how'd you get... Yeah, I was like, how'd you get into that school? I it's don't... a little scary how every building was unlocked at some point. That's weird. You sent me a voice note at 1 a.m. like, yeah, I'm in my school. <laughs> yeah, I was like, okay. Surprisingly, I wasn't drunk. No, you're completely sober. Yeah, I was completely know, sober, there, just breaking there. into the school. <laughs> I hope somebody saw it, because it, was, I don't, it wasn't moving weekend yet, so there's just not very many people there. But there are people walking around at 1 a.m. in the school campus. I just hope through the art building, because there's mannequins and stuff, that someone's just looking up, and there's just, like, mannequins, but then there's, like, one of the moves, and it's just me, and they're like, what the fuck? <laughs> what is that? <laughs> I'm just a legend of these people. Pot on the board. Oh no! Oh my God! What does it <laughs> mean? <laughs> I'm waiting to see if cops show up in my dorm because I'm. I did that and I went home and I was like, maybe I was drunk. I would never have done that. Like, why did I go there and write that stuff? <laughs> and then I was like, it would. It would of course be my luck that the night I did that, like a homeless person burned in the next. Th- like it's something horrible would have happened and they would have tracked that. Like, yeah, we gotta find out who test. was here the night of the crime. Yeah. Oh, good thing he left his signature on every board in the science building. <laughs> Wait, they every board? More than one? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. No. Maybe I was drunk. <laughs> it doesn't really make any sense. Like, I woke Spray up. painting it on the toilet seat. <laughs> I woke yeah. up. And I, I wrote it in blood. Po- Is that wrong? <laughs> 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 oh, sorry. That didn't look right. I don't know what I was doing there. <laughs> I was holding a paintbrush. <laughs> sorry. Yeah, I know, right? I was like, why is it both double, <laughs> double fisting a You know when you paint, like... Oh, damn, Daniel. <laughs> damn, Daniel. Oh, no. Great, bring back that meme. Oh, my gosh, the worst. I didn't know that was a meme at first. People were just You didn't? Me. It was everywhere. It was annoying. People I were just good. coming up to you and being like, damn, yep. and then you're like, people like me. That's exactly what happened. I was like, oh, cool. And I was like, damn, Daniel. And you're like, huh, okay, okay. Yeah, they're, and then they're you just find making fun of you, but you're you think like, they're oh, like, shit. I don't have white shoes. <laughs> <laughs> the white like, vans. What is he? Oh, you have a van. Are you talking about my yeah, mom's are you van? Talking it about is like, a nice van. One. You want to come check out the van later? It's light powder baby blue. <laughs> my uncle has a white van. We yeah. go in every week. Sorry. <laughs> You guys really like the uncle uncle yeah, jokes. I feel bad. My uncles are really good people, so <laughs> just to clarify. And you're like, sorry, Uncle Jimmy. 
That's actually his name. <laughs> Are you serious? Yeah. <laughs> well done, Juliana. Yeah. You win Dots this round. Dots is his family. <laughs> Dots is my entire family. Thanks a lot, Juliana. Sorry. I just said a random white guy name and just assumed they, they could have been. And it worked. And it worked. Daniel's like the fourth most popular name in America, I think. So Really? It's not like we're winning any awards for most popular. I don't know any Daniels. I've told you this. I only know like Danny's and Dan's. I felt like an idiot. I feel like uh, we were in our one of our uh, master's classes a little while ago, and uh, our teacher was asking us like what everyone's names are and stuff like that. And she, I, she was like, she's uh, into foreign language studies, so we were getting the meanings of stuff. Well, anyway, she came to me, and I was like, my name's Daniel, and she said something like, like, how, like, what does that mean, or something? And I thought she meant like, what does your name mean? So I like quickly explained what it meant. She was like, no, I actually meant like what does this mean here in the corner of your room or something? And I was like, did I just go into a fucking explanation about what my name means? And she was sitting there like, no, sorry, I meant this. <laughs> what did you say I your name like, meant? I was like, oh, no. I feel like I wouldn't even idiot. know what to say my name meant. I'm like, it's in letters. It's Hebrew for, like, letters. God is my protector, I think. But I went into this, like, oh. thing on Hebrew. And she was like, oh. no, dumbass. She's like, I meant your psych protector. poster in the background. What did you say, Nick? God is my protector. Jesus is my witness. <laughs> You're going full on into prayer, and she's just like. I start rising off the seat, my eyes are open <laughs> in the back of my head. I meant the poster. I, she's, I just, like, so, she's like, no, 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 I meant the. No, okay, whatever. Um, he anyway, floated off the screen. <laughs> <laughs> she just mutes me. The screen's like fizzing. I'm like choking myself. Yeah. She's like, okay, and moving on to the next topic. Your little window's just fire. Glitching, <laughs> yeah. Like, there's just a fire that starts in the corner. The room's just swirling. And you see my face like come out of the flames, like. <gasps> she's like, and I then we come Daniel. over to this part of the text. <laughs> Daniel, you <bro." laughs> <laughs> Beans! <laughs> Ignore him! It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It happens one per session. At least I don't once know. per session. I used, to be, I used to know how to talk to people. Not anymore. Yeah, I've started to, to get poopy at it. I've noticed when I'm in group settings, I'm like, um, what do I talk to any of my friends about anymore? Like, no one is doing anything in my life. Right. Well, we were at the bar last night, and that's everyone. It, it, we always come to the topic of, so what have you been doing? And everyone's like, work, and you're like, all right, yeah, then. and it's moving like moving on. Old. Give me another beer. Honestly, most of my friends are unemployed, so they can't even talk about work either. I'm like, what do you guys do all day? And they're like, uh, I, I, and they're like, I actually don't know. And I'm like, what? <laughs> they're like, where Hold does on. the time go? <laughs> What's up at the wall? And it's 4 p.m. I don't know when. That's what happens to me. I every stare day. at the I'm, wall. I wake up. My beans are gone. I'm out. In the- I Make swear, it in the street. I got shot. <laughs> I, yeah, I'm like, I swear, lately, I'm just like, I, I barely get out of bed anymore. I just stare, like, at the ceiling, and then I realize, like, two hours have passed, and it feels like no time Jeez. at all. Like, I, I'm not even watching TV or on my phone. What's I'm that just like? sitting there. And then I don't, I don't sleep either, so it's like the days feel so long. And I'm like, when will it end? When will this end? <laughs> I can't imagine. If I go 20 minutes, I literally, this weekend, I had 30 minutes where I had, like, nothing to do, and I was just watching TV, just with not doing anything. I didn't have to eat, didn't have to do any work while I was watching. I was just sitting there, and after 30 minutes, I was like, okay, I'm missing something. Something has to be being something done. Something has to be bad. Freaked out. I was like, I'm forgetting something. I couldn't do it, man. I, don't, I couldn't fucking do it. Well, the thing is, that... when I'm assigned a task, it's like that's when I really want to just do anything but the task. But when yeah. I have free time, I'm like, I don't want to just watch something. I don't want to just lay here. This sucks. <laughs> yeah. It, I hate, I love being like busy. And I used to be somebody who was just like constantly doing something all day, every day. And now I'm like totally the opposite of that. I just don't do anything all day. And everyone's like, who have you become? And I'm like, I couldn't tell you. My Nobody. mom was like, remember when you used to have like like motivation do you remember that and i'm <laughs> and potential and i'm like yeah i do that's, that's so nice. sad it's always it's your mom like coming in with day. the good encouragement she always has <laughs> oh golly we need to frame her quotes on the wall or put those on a shirt 
on my mom has, my Why mom don't has you a just bunch kill of stuff yourself? in her house that's like actually like live laugh love. She has like three live laugh love things. Three. Is she okay. living laughing yeah. and loving? Living laughing loving. Three. It's like a it's like a sociopath saw it at a, like a state fair and they're like humans buy these. <laughs> I, I'll <laughs> take three. I'll take three. They're they're all different, but yeah, they all say that on there. So that yeah, would be she's... worse if they were all the same. <laughs> yeah. Live, laugh, love, up. live, laugh. Just to remind you, when you're in a different corner of the house, you're still live, laughing, loving. You're still like, live, uh, laughing, loving, uh, right? Uh, right? Uh, uh, yeah, today my mom was like, "What? Uh, where's your? what's your super smart friend doing? What's he up to? And I was like, um, nothing. And then she's like, like, is he, he's not working? And I was like, no, he plays video games all day. And she was like, are you serious? He, he can be, like, solving world hunger right now. He's, like, actually a genius. <laughs> and I'm like, well, this... <laughs> She's like, I swear your friend group is like the lost generation. Like, half of you are so smart and have so much potential, and then you just sit there and do nothing all day. And I'm like, yep. That's... Or you play that, there you were in that dumb podcast with those yeah. engineers that yeah, yeah, make been... the stupid videos all day. Yeah, What's this video with keeps... soup that I'm hearing about? <laughs> so... Everybody keeps asking me what I'm doing, and I'm like, um, well, I have a podcast currently, and then everybody just like changes the subject immediately. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, don't oh talk no. About it. Don't acknowledge it. No yeah, exactly. They're like, so I'm doing. And I'm like, <laughs> that's so sad. I know. I'm like, oh no. <laughs> uh, I don't know what to say to that. Yeah, and then my friend's moms are like, like, are you taking any classes right now? Or are you working? And I'm like, no. And then, like, I can't say I'm doing a podcast, but then my friend will be like, Oh, she started a podcast and I'm like <sighs> and then they're like about what and I'm like comedy? we don't know <laughs> yeah I'm like comedy question mark and they're like poop yeah <laughs> poop, poop. they're like you you make funny I didn't know you were funny. our poop stories yeah you want to hear a poop story I shit myself in the original pancake house <laughs> <laughs> That's I love, still, I, I still replay that, lively, that video. Yeah, Lively was I'm bullying sad. me, and she's, I don't know, I forgot what she said, and I, I posted her, like, shitting herself in the pancake house or whatever. <laughs> <you know>. Yeah. <laughs> That's literally one of the funniest videos I've ever seen. It's such a fucking meme, and I replay it way too often, dude. I was so dude. upset. I was so upset. I had the same, it's just I'm so like... funny that you were upset, but you chose to film yourself after, <laughs> then caption it, then publicize it. That's what blows my mind. <laughs> Yeah, you know. It would make more sense if someone filmed you while you were doing that, being upset, and you didn't. You did it to yourself. You were literally like, in the coffee. you were like, all right, I was... I've just shitted in the coffee house. <laughs> yeah, I was hanging out with my brother's friends like the next weekend, and my brother was telling them about how I shit myself, and then they were like, how old were you when this happened? And I was like, last Friday. And they were like, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> I was like, mm-hmm. yes. And they're like, how did this happen? And I was like, well, I didn't expect it to come. Uh, my brother ripped a big fart, and I was like, yeah, and I was like, oh, yeah, and then I just shit myself. <laughs> you said this last so time. Triggered. The ultimate yeah. power move. Yeah, <laughs> so I was he, like, oh, So God. he's just like, and you're like, oh, yeah? Fucking <laughs> one up. <laughs> yeah, and I was like, you can't beat this. <laughs> Shit's blood. Yeah. Blood's just spurting out of your fucking eyes. <laughs> oh! Yeah. Oh, yeah, get this. <laughs> Ultimate power move, dude. And I was like, dude, I shit myself, and my brother's like, ha ha. And I'm like, no, really? Like, walk behind me when we leave the restaurant. <laughs> Hand me a pancake. I gotta wait. <laughs> <laughs> Hand me a pancake. I got a Darth Vader waffle maker the other day. From Goodwill. From which Goodwill. Is questionable. Ew. Ew. Right, hey, I From sanitized Goodwill. it. I sanitized Ew. it. Ew. Ew. Hey. Sanitize it. She goes, yeah, <laughs> no kidding. You don't know what people have put in there. Well, you know, a fucking insane fine family. To me. Uh, yeah, I'm sure it did. The last <laughs> family that waffled come up in that thing. <laughs> I don't want to know what they put in that waffle maker. I don't think anyone has said the term waffled come. <laughs> I don't think that's a phrase. I know. I, I have invented something. Yay! Yay! This is on my one resume. accomplishment. <laughs> Inventor. Let's see, I had four years of undergrad for mechanical engineering. I'm getting my master's in MBA. Uh, Coined the, the phrase waffle, waffle cum. Cum. Yes. <laughs> They're like, hey, what's up with this last one? The MBA? No, no, no. The one... <laughs> the four years of under... Yeah, no, 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 no. The, the, the one with the Darth Vader... What, what was it? Waffle cum. Waffle cum. Okay, got it, got it. Okay. Got um, it. Great. You're hired. <laughs> you're hired. 
Why would you ever get any food thing from Goodwill? That's a terrible to. idea. Even well, I don't absolute know. psychopath. Goodwill's well. for like, sh- like shovels and spades and something like something <laughs> that you're not gonna <laughs> wear. Spades. It's the first thing I thought of. Something Barbie? you're not gonna wear and something you're not gonna eat. Something doesn't. You've never bought inside. clothes. You've never from bought Goodwill? clothes from Goodwill. I bought so. No. You're rich crazy. person, rich person things, Dan. No, you're, no, I've had the same clothes since. Ha, no, I'm moderate this wealth. Ha, ha. Mo- oh, yeah, ha, fuck ha, off, ha, fuck ha, you. Ha. We're lower middle class, Daniel. Get out of here with your upper middle class. Eat my ass, okay? <laughs> I didn't buy new clothes. We didn't have money for it, so I just wore the same clothes. That's why you, go to, That's why you go to Goodwill. That's why you go to Goodwill. Don't have money better. for Goodwill. It's like two bucks a shirt. You don't shirt. have what money do you for Goodwill. What do you mean? It's better for the environment as well. You're reusing clothes. What? Versus How do you not? What? How is that better versus for the environment? They sit in a clothes. pile of good world. They sit on your shirt. Like, what's the difference? Versus buying new clothes. I don't buy new clothes, so I'm doing just fine in the but Earth's point did, of view. You, where did your clothes come from? Uh, I don't know, like middle school somewhere. I don't know. What? You still wear your middle school? <laughs> I don't I, remember where I bought I my clothes. I still wear my middle school stuff. Well, yeah, but you're tiny. I yeah. was well, like, super this, skinny this in middle school. Now they fit me. Like the 80s. Like I wear, I just wear old stuff all the time. This this dress I'm wearing right now was my friend's, and she gave it to me. I don't I don't buy new clothes I ever. I stole it. I stole it. <laughs> this jacket's four years old. My my sandals are like holes in them. They're like a year old. My shoes well, are two years old. Well, you can you old. can buy new shoes, sir. You That's... can you can upgrade. <laughs> can I? <laughs> I don't need should... new ones yet. They're still doing okay. There's people paying you on Patreon just buy some new sandals. Yeah, just... They're not that bad, dude. Oh my god, those my are god. terrible. <laughs> There's like three separate holes, and they're sand. They're like yeah, for one, the big toe and the thingy and the heel. <laughs> <laughs> comfort maximum comfort why are you laughing i'm gonna take a picture of that and that's gonna be like the poster for the <laughs> please subscribe to our patreon <laughs> we need money please for new get daniel shoes. some new Buy sandals, some sandals. <laughs> please daniel what please. size are you <laughs> oh my gosh okay I'm, whatever new, size new shoes. i can get <laughs> you can buy new shoes that's one of the things i'll tell you you can okay. do that's okay <laughs> fine Oh, I actually do have a gift card for. Sh- oh, look at that! I do. I can get new shoes. I totally forgot about that. Yay. I've got a Dick's gift card. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> <laughs> Dick's. How funny name. Haha, <laughs> funny name. I can buy for penis burger, shoes. For the burger restaurant. For the for the sporting goods store. The burger restaurant. <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> <laughs> Cooked meat. Let's call it Dick's. Yeah, it's delicious. It's the best. Yeah, we don't have it- any around here. We got five guys. We've got Red Robin. And that's it. Meatheads in Chicago in and Bloomington Meatheads is good. You ever been to Meatheads, Nick? Yeah, there's one like down the street. Oh, I <laughs> fucking love Meatheads. They're fries. Do you guys are remember amazing. that show, Mr. Meaty? Yes. Oh, it was so no, disturbing. I don't. It was what so dis- happened? Daniel, you should Google what it looked like. Oh, just, just to, I don't just know to if see I it. should. But that well, show, it's a good like. Show, but it's continue a little, talking. That show, and like. It's puppets <laughs> and raw meat. Yeah. Hey, was, what? That show would make my stomach hurt. Like, it just physically. Ew. Made me Did you look it up? <laughs> it would make me feel gross. Oh, I my just, gosh. I know no, this maybe. show. Yeah. How do you know bucket. this show? Because it disturbed me as a child. I was flipping channels. You know this, channels. but you don't know Coconut Fred? <laughs> yeah, I was flipping channels, and there was a scene where he was trying not to eat a fucking burger, but like it kept disappearing or something. And then like he had a coworker <laughs> watch him, and some snake tapeworm thing came out of his mouth yes, and grabbed him. And I was like, what one? the fuck? Dude, yeah, that show's in... Like what the fuck is that? That's not a kid's the show, is it? meat. Yeah, it was. I think it was on Nickelodeon. No. It was on Ew, Nickelodeon. that was a kid's show? It was disgusting. Show? It was disgusting. Why? <laughs> Somebody Ew. just thought it was a good idea to make Don't you remember like, that era of really cartoons disturbed? where gross-out appeal was, like, the big thing? Yeah, it well, really that was. was part except, of that era still. Except, like, Courage the Cowardly Dog. There was, like, weird stuff in it, but Ew. I really liked that show. I loved it. And I was never... Dog. Yeah, I was never grossed out by that show. I thought it kind of had like a creepy vibe sometimes, but that well, was yeah, part that of the one appeal. demon like in the middle of the cornfield. Yeah, like, the live action like, demon. Mm, yes, yes, yes. You remember mm, that? Yeah, but that's just scary. That's not disturbing, you know. Yeah, it was uh, disturbing. A tapeworm 
from like, coming out of the burger employee's throat to eat a burger. That's that's fucking yeah, that's just insane. Gross. That's just gross. There was one. There was another Cartoon Network show. I don't remember what it was. Flapjack. That was that really disturbed me. It may have been Flapjack. I don't, I don't know. There was a kid running from eyeball Chowder. creatures. They were just I eyeballs. He's running from eyeballs, and the eyeballs chased after him, and they like sucked themselves to his face. This is a kid's cartoon I show. I don't remember that one. It was absolutely terrifying, watching, and I was afraid of eyeballs after that. I was afraid. Hey, Somebody hey, looks spoiler you in the alert! Eyes. I'm not trying to freak you out. Trigger warning, but you have to. <laughs> I look in the mirror. I'm like, <laughs> yeah. Stab now him I out. don't have any. Now I don't have any. <laughs> now where am I? <laughs> well, now where was I? <laughs> oh my gosh. No, uh, flapjack was interesting, but it was always like really weird animation styles that made stuff look grotesque. And Chowder was just funny to me. It was a weird show, but that was like one of my favorite shows. I loved that show. Was that a Monster House show? Which Are you talking one? about Monster House? I don't know. Maybe. <laughs> oh, that's the movie with the animation. Yeah. yeah no, when they're like, that. so it's a girl house, and it's like, oh, there's the <laughs> the uvula. Yeah. <laughs> Damn it. Oh, <laughs> certified Oscar classic right there. Monster House. Yeah. Ugh. Ugh. All right. Well, we are coming, I think, to that time. So I was going to pull up notes from our, our two patrons, our two lovely patrons Alrighty. that uh, we, yeah. <clears throat> we lost one? <laughs> <laughs> wouldn't, wouldn't doubt it. I'm we sorry, guys. It. I'm sorry. All right. I'm pulling it up. I should have had it ready to go. Okay. Um, here's the note. Here's done note. Is what it says. I haven't read these yet. Don't note. I enjoy the bonus episodes and extra content released on Patreon. No, I'm not paid to say this. I would donate more to a higher tier, but most of my funds have been used for the pelvis replacement surgery that was necessary after I OD'd on walkie slush and my bones turned to pudding. Delicious. <laughs> yes, I brought walkie slush up again. Take that, Smithy, Alabama. <laughs> <laughs> Dad never came back from the smokes, and now I'm wondering if Dora is responsible somehow for the Kennedy assassination. Pray for Scooby-Doo. He's about to be Scooby-neutered. <laughs> I mean, with Dora being ten feet tall, she would have been a much clearer shot at the at the convertible. Just saying. <laughs> oh goodness! Well, that was fun. Uh, that was from Turntable Trog of the Night. Uh, the one from Smithy, Alabama. I did start to read this because it worried me at first, but it, it gets better. I want, so here's the message. I want to hear your thoughts on media degradation as a whole. Have you guys seen the new wave of hypersexual and hyperviolent content on television and social media? When I was younger, I always thought that it wouldn't have had an impact on anyone, but it's pretty obvious now that it's slowly warping the youth. Underage girls are making thirsty posts on TikTok for older pedophiles, and young boys are watching violent drivel and playing explicit shooters like Call of Duty. It's honestly heartbreaking. It seems today that all you see is violence in movies and sex on TV. But where are those good old-fashioned values which we used to rely? Lucky there's a family guy. Lucky there's a man who positively can do all the things that make us laugh and cry. He's a family guy. <laughs> The new Rick Roll, dude. That one got me I when I first that? read it. I was reading through this like, oh my gosh. <laughs> so and he says, okay, real question. And said, okay, real question. Who would win in a fight, Superman or Sheen from Jimmy Neutron? Keep in mind that canonically Superman died of super cancer and All Star Superman. <laughs> Keep this in mind. We'll make your decision. My Instagram and Twitter handles are both Pokimane. I'm not gonna read that. <laughs> <laughs> Who, okay, here we are again. I don't know who Sheen from Jimmy Neutron is. Is that the friend? You don't remember Sheen? Is that the he friend, was, with, the, that the friend with the annoying the voice? What, are you talking about Carl Weezer? No, the, the the one with that... Talks like this, Jimmy! I don't, I've never seen the show. So that's, it's I've Carl seen it Weezer? Like that's not Carl it's not Weezer. It's not fucking <laughs> Carl. I know that. Carl Weezer is like this. Jimmy. <laughs> Jimmy's mom. <laughs> you gonna finish that croissant? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, so is Sheen the one with like the the, the triangle one, head? Yeah. Okay, thank you. You're like, see, he, does he have the rectangle about. head? Yeah, he's the he's the dumb friend. He would win one thousand. Yeah, he would win. Like he I never smoked. dies. I literally talked like I smoked, and Juliana was like, "You mean Carl Weezer?" <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, Weezy. <laughs> yeah. That's from Toy Story. <laughs> That's Toy Story. What's the difference? Are you saying Wheezy and Toy Story smoked a pack? Is that what I'm hearing? Yeah. 
when he's like, Wheezy, get out from there. And he's like, ah. Woody, I gotta get out of here. Andy's gonna come back. Andy's gonna kill me. They're taking my throat. You're gonna Sheen, take my life. without a doubt, Sheen would win. Yeah, what about when Sheen uh, gets, like, the giant head and has, like, super Sheen got a head? <laughs> Sheen got head, bro? <laughs> what kind of show was, was I watching? No, that happened on Planet Sheen. Don't you remember that? I've not uh, seen I didn't watch all, Planet so I Sheen. I didn't watch it either. Did. There was watched... a there was a monkey in it. <laughs> a chimp. I what? Think. <laughs> what are we talking about? There's a chimp where? Uh, underwear. <laughs> <laughs> what are we talking about? Moving on. Anywho. It's Sheen all the way. Fuck Superman. What a basic superhero. <laughs> Boo! So, I feel like Superman's one of those superheroes that no one quite knows what to do with in a movie now. I don't know. Maybe that's just me. Yeah, they, they CGI his mustache out and put <laughs> yeah. a fake mouth over it. It's that great. was the worst thing I've ever seen. Isn't it crazy? <laughs> it's like the, the an, like, anime voiceover and lip sync. And then his like speed thing, he just is like flump and goes to the next like panel. <laughs> like <laughs> that's awful. We need to see the cut of Superman with the mustache. I don't know why we haven't it gotten exists. that yet. Does it now? That's Omni Man. It's uh, the Snyder. Cut I do too. need to see that show. <laughs> you haven't seen that? No, I'm currently watching Dexter. I mean, Invincible's only like ten episodes, and they're like. Yeah, that's minutes, what I saw. Short. I need to. I need to see it. It's really short. I keep it's hearing good. everyone talk about it, and I really like uh, what's his name, the main guy, that's the mustached guy. What's his name in real life? Superman. J.K. Simmons. J.K. Simmons. <laughs> Superman. <laughs> so, nope, not that. I keep you, seeing the memes for about... when he's on the rock, and I'm like, I, someday I'll know what that. Someday means. I'll get that. Someday you, I'll get are you that. talking about the yellow peanut M and M? He what? also voices. Yeah, he voices. <laughs> I was like, wait, what's she talking about? What? <laughs> J.K. Simmons voices the, the voice yes. Yeah. yes, yes, yes. After the what? Night. The range. Since, since the two thousands, yeah. What? The yes. range. Yes. No. Yes. The range on that man, that man. knows no bounds. Yeah, he's oh great. Oh my goodness, I, I that's that beautiful. <laughs> what a man! Have you seen? Did you see him training for fucking now. Justice League? <laughs> he's huge. He's huge. He's jacked. He's huge. Why? I don't get it. Yeah, what he's is... like in his sixties. He's just like a bearded old man. He had a full-on Santa like... beard. And he's just full-on jacked. You're like, holy yep. shit. Santa Claus, the live-action thriller. <laughs> yeah. Come here, kids. Yeah, he's just, like, smashing <laughs> he their kills heads. the naughty ones. Snaps you know, the like, neck all right on his lap. In, Smushes in their scene. head down in the yeah, presence say, and suffocates him. Yeah, in... I in see in, you when you're sleeping. <laughs> in Invincible, his character actually I know just, like, smashes I see you when you're away. sleeping. <laughs> <laughs> That's hilarious. I'd watch that. I'd he's watch just harpooning that. kids, like, before they Wait. get in line. That's a movie. Yeah, I was gonna say, isn't there what a is? scary Mel Gibson. movie? No, Mel Gibson. Batman. Batman. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Was that movie was actually it? good. I liked it. Yeah. Okay, here's realized. the thing, though. It's a, here's the warning, though. The trailer makes it look like it, the whole thing's a comedy parody. It's not. It's actually serious, and they actually make like it's not bad serious. Like you, you, you would think. I, you would think the way I'm describing it, that you'd be like, you'd be seeing them attempting to be serious, and you'd be like, "This is fucking stupid." But I was totally into it, dude. I don't know. I thought it was really good. <laughs> I was right, into I'll it. Watch it. It's definitely not what I was expecting. I don't like to recommend stuff though because everybody's different. So don't come back to me and say you hate it. But no, I, 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 I like it. Remember now that it exists. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm sorry That's for bringing up that live action no, Santa Claus movie, guys. God, no, it's but, not you. I just you guys are like. <laughs> No, I was ready December. yesterday. I was ready yesterday, and Juliana What's up ruined with... it. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Sorry, it was my mom. What's up with all the horror Christmas movies? There's so many. I love them. It's it's always mm. like holidays. They always have to have a holiday that's based around horror. So Christmas Christmas isn't that many. Christmas has uh, Christmas Krampus, has and that's almost it. Black Christmas and Jack Frost. Ginger What's Dead the Gremlins? Man. Gremlins. They have one. That's it, with, isn't it? Um, there was like some sorority girls getting killed. What's that one? Last uh, Christmas or something. Like it's that. something close to Black Christmas. I can't Last remember what it's called. Christmas. I think that's it's something like that. Girl Christmas. Girl <laughs> Dead <laughs> Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> I'd watch a movie with that title. <laughs> I would. I would. See, they don't. Girls me. die <laughs> Christmas. <laughs> Girls dying on Christmas. Girls die. Rated R. Christmas. 
That's the title. <laughs> Rated R is the title. <laughs> In the middle. I had like a thing. Girl die, up. harpoon, boobs, rated R, Christmas. Yeah, I had a thing pop rated up. Rated R. Like, Here's a role that you're, you've are you been matched with. And then it was like unnamed like project. And it was like, this project is very edgy. That was like the first thing. And it said like warning. And it was like, there will be, you will be in your underwear for the majority of the film. And there nice. will be nudity. And I was like, what is, what is this about? But they didn't describe it at all. It's just like, oh, we just want pictures of girls boobs i was gonna say that sounds like a creepy guy's like snapchat dm yeah but except yeah. he set up a an whole offer you got or wait what yeah Did it was you... an offer i got on like backstage or whatever it's called i don't on know backstage was... of all places yeah it was like a good place what yeah i know right it's the one un- oh backstage is like America. it's kind of i think it's the biggest like actor like audition kind of online site isn't it juliana yeah you guys are both on that I don't pay for it, it, but I, yeah, I'm I, on the I newsletter. Just that pops up, yeah, and then they're like, "Here's something you've been cast for, and I, or like you you've been matched with for a potential role." And I was like, "Just nude? It is it just because I'm a girl? Was that the only reason I was matched with this?" Like, <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, I get some really interesting ones. It's like a disabled, depressed, like middle aged <laughs> man, and I was like, "What?" <laughs> and you're like, "I put all those except the man part." <laughs> yeah, I was like, "Hey, yeah." Hey. hey guys, knock it off. Hey guys, <laughs> quit looking at. Me. It's, but it would make it creepier as if you didn't ever input those things in. They're, no, they're I didn't. Just like, we I just didn't. know. We just know <laughs> yeah. you've got all these problems. Who do you think yep, you'd do well? Who do you think you? The serious question. Who do you think you'd do well as in a movie? To Julian like, one day, anybody? Like, what do you think you'd be best cast as? The awkward pizza boy. I have no dude, idea. dude, I fi- I'm the type yeah, cast that, for that. Yeah, that'd be kind of good. <laughs> the comedic timing pizza boy when people are dying in the house, and I'm like, yeah, yes. like anybody order a sausage? Completely serious the whole time, and he's like, <laughs> winking at the guy that's like spurting blood in the and corner. Like, she has extra, a gun to her head, and I'm like, large. you want extra large sauce? And dude, that's that's, that's the TikTok I made. That's I'm gonna do sometime next week. It's it's just so stupid, but I was super proud of it. There's a video cam on my for you page of a guy doing that. He's wearing pants that are the same shade as his skin, so I full on thought he was just fucking naked, except for the pizza box in front of his dick. But he walks into frame, he's like, anybody order an extra large? And then it's a stitch, so the next part cuts to me opening a pizza box. I'm like, who ordered the Little Caesars? Ha! <laughs> and then I pull out a hammer and I smash it, and it cuts right at the smash. <laughs> I'm, in, I'm not funny. I'm sorry. I'm not- <laughs> I love, I love just like reading my notes on jokes I've made and like skits and like uh, I, when I, especially when I don't remember like what I was trying, <laughs> trying to get at and I was like, where's the joke in this? And it's like, then you walk in and yell and I'm like, wait. That's mine, except they're too, they're too short, so I don't know what they mean. Like I, I was telling Nick yeah. this. I, word for do, word. do you want me to read yeah, through some? That. I, I should. Do, like, I need to now. Bullet points and like, and then I never get to making them. But I'm like, I I think this was funny. I'm gonna read through these like it's a like. What do you guys? What you guys call it that one episode? Smash poetry. What's it called? Oh, slam. Slam, slam poetry. poetry. <laughs> so just read it. <laughs> these are just one line things in here that I don't know what they. Yeah, and some of them you can kind of tell. <laughs> Uber, but bathrooms. <laughs> Pooper. <laughs> Cop is too graphic with mom on phone. What does that mean? I don't know. <laughs> Throw mouse at wall. Doesn't work. Go to the vet. <laughs> oh, yes. It's a real mouse. I Black get it. panther and pink panther. <laughs> Do whatever mm-hmm. in hotel rooms like kill. Uh-huh. Boomerangs fall up. <laughs> <laughs> I have this one. This reminds I have me one. how unfunny I am. Helpful this ghost is... reminds to flush toilet. <laughs> This one is. This one says, "In search of dungeon master, uh, sub, but also D and D." That's all it says. Nice. <laughs> Downton Alley, but with Downton Abbey, but Downton Abbey with drugs or Downton Alley. <laughs> Can't even fucking say it. Pothole equals hole with pot in it. <laughs> nice. Yes, Daniel, that's hilarious. You should uh-huh. film that's that good one. one. That's Look, a good that's one. a pothole. That's a hole that's just got bags of coke in it. That's, that's like exactly. I know. That's the joke. <laughs> that would be a crack hole. <laughs> yeah. Good. Oh, oh! I have one I can make. It's yes. a glory hole, but it just has the movie Glory in a in a ditch. 
Same formula, different joke. Using different it. Different joke. <laughs> Do it. Make it. Uh, the only script that I have on my screen is guy walks in, asks, do you believe in ghosts? Guy says, yeah. Other guy asks, do you want to see some? Guy says, sure. Other guy pulls out gun and it just ends like that. <laughs> Perfect. That's like an ASDF skit. That's funny. It's like something that's super short and fits well. I would die. I, that would live out my life's purpose if I could voice one person in an ASDF movie. That'd be perfect. That's I my life's real. They didn't really like hit their peak, though. They're all not that good anymore. I thought I it was the opposite. Understand. They were worse in the beginning. They're awful. The first well, few. Well, yeah, but that's gets better timed after that. comedy. <laughs> <laughs> Any comedy from 2011 that's on the internet is trash now. That's I baked you a pie. What, what flavor? flavor? Pie flavor. <laughs> no, they're so bad. Oh, do you remember the TikTok that got turned into that sound from that? Oh my gosh, that I hated I it so much. I don't know TikToks. Oh boy, what flavor? Pie, pie, pie. pie, pie. pie. <laughs> <laughs> so bad. Lively. Damn so me. Glad he didn't yeah, yeah, I'm mm. so glad he didn't. Sorry. Especially Pass with the guys that. with the rubber faces. Oh, God. Yeah, I don't. I never know any like TikTok references. Like my friends will That's say. That's fine. My friends will say like a joke, but it's just like an audio clip that they use over other things, and like they say it in real life, and they're like, "Who? Who is that? Who, oh, what is this?" And then I'm like, "Is this? I don't get. I don't get it. Is it?" Is that da Vinky? <laughs> That's what I was I kind of like Da Vinky. <laughs> they'll message me Da Vinky every now and then. If I Who post, does? Just people in general. If I just post anything, Good. they'll just say like, oh, Da Vinky? And I'm like... You're like, it's like a picture with your family. Still? Yeah. Da Vinky? You're like, I'm, uh, Yeah, no, literally. I'll post a picture with my friends and they'll put Da Vinky. <laughs> I'm like, You're like who are you? Doing, dude? Like their joke Stop. is just using someone else's punchline? <laughs> yeah. I you mean that. like TikTok is? Yes. You know what the worst... Okay, I'm going to talk about this really quick. I know we got to wrap up, but I just yeah. want to make this point. The thing that I hate the most about TikTok is using a setup and a whole joke, but changing the words on the screen. I hate that. I hate that so much. Yeah. Because it's using so the structure of someone else's joke, and it's just literally if you were just like, yeah, but what if it was that, but with, like, my dad? <laughs> Yeah, Hilarious. and then they need, they're all mouthing. They need is the audio, yeah, all they need is the audio punchline, but they're mouthing. The they're mouthing audio. Yeah, yeah, Just they're the mouthing. The words are completely it. different. Yeah. Well, did you see the video that I made on the? Uh, so that happened. So Evan, you know Evan Collins, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um. So I saw there's a there was a huge viral sound on TikTok, and it, the the premise was, but well, you don't look gay. Oh, I'm yeah, sorry. Well, let me just I've, and then like nah, 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 and music plays. Yeah, that's well, funny. I I recognized his voice immediately. I was like, that's I recognized Evan. his voice. Too. That's I Evan. Was like, I was and like, so I, I know that I have that video downloaded. So I then I binged his profile until I found it, and I was like, there it is. And I told Evan, I was like, dude, this is going viral. I'm sorry that like no one's crediting you. And he was like, yeah, yeah, it's too bad. But then I like made a video on it because I was like, I was super pissed off because that's I've seen all it on of a them. bunch of like random videos, like well, people just using it. And it's not funny either. It's all like stereotypes. Like why do yeah. you think that's funny? Because all of them are like, you don't look, I don't know, Muslim or something. And then the yeah. person that's Muslim will dress up and hold a plane and like, I'm like, what do you do? How is this helping anything? It's super offensive. Yeah. Just, I don't understand why people think any of that's funny. And then everyone's doing that with their whatever it is and i'm like yeah, yeah hilarious ha, ha ha yeah i recognize like their voice and i was like dude i i followed this person on on bite and tried to message them every single like video they made and i'm like you're so funny and never would get a response but i'm like because I mean, you're not funny no I'm kidding. Yeah. <laughs> literally you're so There's you're so me. funny <laughs> Evan is genuinely one of the funniest people I've I've that's on that app. Evan is the He's only person so I know that can post like five funny. videos a day, and all of them will be. I'll bangers. watch all yeah. of them because he's it's the perfect everything. He's in complete control of every emotion, every pause. I mean, everything is structured perfectly yeah. to my delivery. sense of humor. It's yeah. so good. I love it so and much. And then they're like they're like low effort, but still so funny. Those are like the videos I love. Right, it's just like you're just holding the phone. Like it's not any edit. Nothing I wish I was that high, good. Nothing highly overproduced. Yeah, I have yeah. to hide my videos and edits to make it seem like it's better than it is. <laughs> I wish I could just film person A, person B. That'd be great. Oh golly. <laughs> on that note, follow me on TikTok. Follow me on TikTok, please. I think we're Daniel, to the what's end. your TikTok? 
We're coming to the end of our time. So, uh, yeah. Uh, What's thank your you guys. Take I'm going to list them. Guess. I wrote notes this time. Okay. Take a wild guess. What is TikTok? I was trying to do so, a segue for you to help. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> so follow, you can follow the the podcast on like any of uh, you know like Spotify and Google and Apple and all that stuff allow you to actually subscribe to the podcast on there so that way when the next episode gets posted it automatically downloads to your phone and notifies you you can do that uh, otherwise uh, you can subscribe to our YouTube which is under the same name the Pequeno Pod and Nick does a tremendous job with the edits on there and they look beautiful thank you thank you um, please consider supporting us on Patreon. <laughs> Um, I know that no one asked us to work as hard as we do on this stuff, but we've uh, spent a lot of time putting into bonus episodes and bonus stuff and just the whole stuff in general. So, And uh, we're coming up with some merch, I think. It's coming soon for that stuff. So, Yep. yep. And then uh, for my personal stuff, uh, well, so first of all, I actually made uh, new profiles for the uh, podcast everywhere, essentially. So they're on, we're on TikTok, Instagram. Um, so pretty much any – whichever – app is your preference we're on it so uh and then personally i'm just senior pequeños everywhere uh tiktok instagram youtube letterboxd if you like movie reviews um yeah that's me nick and Giuliani. you want to plug anything uh you can follow me on tiktok at i have no swag 98 you can follow me on instagram at i have no swag 97 or you can subscribe to me on youtube at nick ochoa if you guys are concerned about the number i can explain next yeah episode. i was like you born in two years no two one different? knows born Ooh. in 1994 jeffrey jeffrey Bezos. born in 2003 <laughs> i hate when i see that like it's not even the 90s <laughs> that's disgusting Dude, don't, partake, don't partake in this trend <laughs> I feel Lively. bad. Yeah, I, need, I don't want to get into Yeah, I was like, topic, I don't even but... get that. I know what that song is from, but I don't get the trend. <laughs> Lively. Hello, we're waiting. Oh, so I, I'm, I need something. to plug something? Plug yeah. your stuff. Yes, hello. Plug your YouTube podcast. profiles. Um, I don't use anything. <laughs> <laughs> and that's all the time we have. <laughs> Thank everybody for listening. Um, we'll see you again in two weeks. So, yep, bye. <laughs> <laughs> Bye-bye.